Welcome to the Fantasy Audiobook. Fantasy. Me. Add friends to become stronger. Chapter 21. After leaving the sect, Meng Chengqing rushed towards the family. As for the transportation tool, it is a spirit horse that the sect has trained for two and a half years. His physical strength is so long that he can easily travel not only a thousand miles a day, but also seven or eight hundred miles. Speaking of which, it seems like I haven't been back for two years. Looking at the distant heaven and earth, Meng Chengqing also felt a faint emotion in his heart. There is no special reason why I don't go back. The main reason is that my cultivation progress is too slow and I feel that I can't live up to my family's resources. But now that I have achieved breakthrough, there is no problem. It can be considered a homecoming. Auntie. A figure appeared in Meng Chengqing's mind. The current president of the Mengxi Chamber of Commerce. She always wears a hat and a black skirt. Strictly speaking, the aunt is not a real aunt. According to the clan elder, she is his mother's junior sister. Also the aperture opening realm martial artist. If it weren't for my aunt, the Meng Chamber of Commerce might have been annexed more than 10 years ago. Over the years, it is also because of his aunt's support that he has been able to enjoy the family's resources without being cut. Drive. Concentrating his thoughts, Meng Chengqing rode his spiritual horse towards the distance. Three days later, White Cloud Mountain Vane, a stretch of mountains stretching for hundreds of miles, with towering ancient trees, steep peaks, and monsters. All in all, it's a dangerous place. Unless you are a martial artist, most people would not dare to come here. The Bayun bandits are a new bandit that has appeared recently. It was so powerful that many passing chambers of commerce were looted, looted and killed. This made people panic, and no one dared to pass by this place. In order to prevent people from knocking on your door, the Bayun bandits were very smart and hid the village very deeply. Unfortunately, this cleverness is not enough in the face of the extreme profundities sect. Once targeted, it can be found in a blink of an eye. Then he was put on a mission. Treat it as an experience for a disciple within the sect. Boom, the tall cottage gate suddenly shattered and turned into countless debris, scattered in all directions. Some bandits who had no time to escape were suddenly swept away, covered in blood. It's quite hidden. An indifferent voice sounded slowly. But at the broken door, a young man in white walked in slowly, stepping on the sunshine. He held the sword in one hand and his black hair danced lightly. A strong aura enveloped the entire place. Enemy attack. There were constant screams. Soon, dense groups of bandits gathered. There are hundreds of them. The strength varies, but they are basically meridian forging realm. And lingering in the second third layer. Just a dozen or so eighth layer ones. As for aperture opening realm, I haven't seen it yet. He is a disciple of extreme profundities sect. Someone spotted Meng Chengqing's clothes, and fear suddenly emerged in their voices. In Tianling state, extreme profundities sect can be said to be the dominant force. It is juxtaposed with Yanyang Valley, Julingmen, and Fengyun City. Outside, no one dares to easily provoke the disciples of these forces. Why panic? Suddenly a deep voice sounded. I saw three figures falling from the sky, standing in front of everyone, confronting Meng Chengqing. It was the leader of the Beiyun bandits and his two deputies. I don't know what the leader's specific name is. Anyway, it is called the Heavenly Bronze Hand Outside. Because this person's boxing and martial arts skills are so good, once used, his fists are like pouring copper water. Not only is it extremely powerful, its defense is even more terrifying. Even if it collides with weapons, it is difficult to be injured. Cultivation is an aperture opening realm seventh layer. Third layer is higher than Meng Chengqing. Therefore, when Meng Chengqing chose this task, the disciples from the task hall also tried to persuade him. In the end I just couldn't say anything. I can only advise you to do your best. A martial artist of this level is almost comparable to an inner disciple. The difference in realm is too big, it is difficult to kill them. He may even die at his hands. But Meng Chengqing is no ordinary inner disciple. Both the, wind and thunder sword art, and, sword steps, have been, cultivated, to perfection, not to mention the sword power is still there. With all his strength, not to mention the seventh layer, the martial artist of the eighth layer and ninth layer will also be awarded the title. Unless they also have a lot of trump cards. Disciple of Extreme Profundities sect, 
Aperture Opening Realm Fourth Layer. Tian Tongshou looked at Meng Changcheng, his expression slightly relaxed. If the level of martial artist is higher than him, then he won't say anything and will just turn around and run away with his deputy. But only Aperture Opening Realm Fourth Layer. Not even his superiors. It can still be solved. It seems that the Extreme Profundities sect has treated as Bayun bandits as a training mission. Tian Tongshou sneered, but you dare to come to the fourth layer realm. You really don't know how to write the word death. Do you think I'm the trash outside? Can you easily surpass the level? You talk so much because you know that you are about to die and you won't have a chance to talk in the future. Meng Chengqing spoke slowly, but his expression was calm. At the same time, I observed the character panels of these three people. Basic information. Name. Tian Tong Shou, Lin Tai. Race. Human race. Cultivation. Aperture opening realm 7th layer. Property information. Root bone. 4th grade. Comprehension. Average. Talent. Rough skin and thick flesh. Martial arts. Monster blood bronze fist. Mastery. Hey, you actually have a talent. Meng Chengqing was a little surprised. The so-called talent refers to certain parts of the body that are different from ordinary people. Not the kind with a bloodline constitution. It can't be compared with these two. Take Bai Suxi's skillful hands for example. Does this guy not know he has this talent? Rough skin and thick flesh, from the name, it sounds like it is a body refining type. If you practice the body refining method, the effect will be obviously better than that of ordinary people. But this day, bronze hands practiced boxing obviously don't know. In fact, this is normal. Talent is not as obvious as bloodline constitution. A lot of people sometimes don't know. This talent is pretty good. Meng Chengqing raised the corners of his mouth slightly. The look in his eyes towards Tian Tong Shou also became softer. If I could get this talent, it would be enough to make the defense of bronze armor technique comparable to that of the profound level, right? As for the other two deputies, there is nothing outstanding about them. Sharp-tongued, sharp-tongued, and surrounded. I don't know whether to live or die. Tian Tong Shou's face was slightly cold. At the same time, my heart sank. In fact, he has been observing this extreme profundities sect disciple. It stands to reason that when he appears on the stage, this person must at least show a cautious look. After all, my cultivation is higher than this person's third layer. But no, nothing at all. He was as calm as ever, and even a little light gradually appeared in his eyes. He knew that look very well. Belongs to hunters. Then everything can be explained. This person is not here to die, but has the confidence to deal with him. Absolutely an unusual extreme profundities sect inner disciple. No matter how many sheep there are, they are still sheep. You don't think these sheep can stop me, do you? Meng Chengqing said softly. He held a sword flower in his right hand, and a faint sword cry could be heard. The words fell. The surrounding bandits suddenly turned red. They have always been wolves, but they are actually called sheep. This is truly a shame and a shame. Ha, huh, it's not you who has the final say whether it's a sheep or a wolf. Want to fight me one on one? Get through them first. Tian Tongshu's eyes were cold. He didn't want to fight Meng Chengqing right away. As soon as all his men are dead, they are all dead. At least it can consume a little bit of this person's strength. At the same time, he can also observe this person's tactics and look for flaws. Facing the inner disciples of the extreme profundities sect, he did not dare to be careless, even if his cultivation level was higher than theirs. Superior, the heavenly bronze hand gave the order directly. The two deputies next to him moved instantly. The bandits surrounding him also roared and surrounded Meng Chengqing. In an instant, dust and sand billowed. However, Meng Chengqing was standing in front of Hengjian, and the two fingers of his left hand slowly brushed the sword. The next second, boom, the wind howled and thunder exploded. There seemed to be electric light flashing. Even more powerful swordsmanship. The deputy and bandits who rushed over flew backwards at a faster speed, vomiting blood, and they didn't know whether they were alive or dead. All this happened in just a moment. Tian Tong Shou's pupils shrank suddenly. He didn't expect such a thing to happen. Not to mention those ordinary bandits, at least the two deputies can fight for a while. Who would have thought it could be so devastating? It's the wind and thunder sword technique of extreme profundities sect, and it has been practiced to perfection. 
When he came back to his senses, Tian Tong Shou looked ugly. Only in this way can we possess such terrifying power. Wait, where is that disciple? Tian Tong Shou's expression suddenly changed slightly, because he found that the figure in his field of vision had disappeared. It's one on one now. The sound coming from his ears was obviously very dull, but it made Tian Tong's hands and scalp numb, as if he had fallen into an ice cellar. What speed is this? How come he was so close to his own in the blink of an eye? Get away! Tian Tong's hand subconsciously punched the right side. The fist was like pouring copper water, filled with an aura of indestructibility. But there was only a bright thunder exploding in front of me. At the same time, there is also an extremely sharp momentum emerging. Like a peerless sword unsheathed. The sharp edge seems to be able to cut the sky and shatter the earth. It made him feel tingly all over. The chi and blood in the body are unconsciously disordered. The most frightening thing is that with the increase in momentum, the lightning has become more fierce. Like a roaring ancient thunder beast. Boom. The moment of collision. Tian Tong Shou's eyes bulged, and bright red blood spurted out of his mouth. There was no resistance at all, and the whole person flew backwards like a cannonball. Knocked down wooden houses. Finally, the whole person was embedded in the huge ancient tree. It caused the leaves to fall and dance all over the sky. You shouldn't be dead, right? Meng Chengqing threw away the broken sword in his hand and quickly ran towards Ji Yumu's position. The heavenly bronze hand is not a weakling after all. The realm is high and the martial arts skills he masters are not bad either. If you don't use sword power, it will still take some time to capture him. For fighting, Meng Chengqing always likes quick decisions. A lion fights a rabbit with all his strength, and he doesn't like to hold back. However, he knew the power of the sword, so he did not fully release it, and with the strength of the heavenly bronze hand, he should not die on the spot. Come to the ancient tree. At this time, Tian Tong Shou was indeed not dead, but he was seriously injured and dying. It looked very miserable. His whole body was covered with sword marks and bleeding. He raised his head with difficulty. Look at Meng Chengqing. His eyes were full of disbelief. You actually understood. The power of the sword. She is the momentum of Martial Dao, an extremely mysterious existence. Only those who need to indulge in Martial Dao for a long time and have extremely high understanding can understand it. And once you realize it, that is almost an existence that is invincible at the same level and easily transcends levels. He didn't expect that one day he would meet him. And he was on the opposite side. Thinking of this, Tian Tong Shou felt a little unwilling. If it were an ordinary inner disciple, he would never be so defeated. But this is, sword power. Absolute crushing. Is this the background of a great force? There can be such a monster even among the inner disciples. Tian Tong Shou stared at Meng Chengqing's face, as if he wanted to remember it forever. You're dying. Meng Chengqing looked at it carefully. Although he had restrained his strength, the power of the sword step, wind and thunder sword technique, plus sword force, and the third layer were still too powerful. All the meridians in Tian Tongshu's body were chopped into pieces. Now he is just holding on with his tyrannical cultivation and physical strength. Hearing this, Tian Tongshu couldn't help but take a deep breath. Needless to say, aren't you the one who made me look like this? In that case, before you die, can you agree to a small request of mine? Meng Chengqing said very seriously. The eyes are sincere. Tian Tongshou was stunned for a moment, a little confused. He was almost dead. What else could it be used for? Any request. Tian Tongshou spoke. Perhaps it was a wound involved, and blood suddenly poured out of his mouth. The breath became more sluggish. Um, are you willing to be my friend? The words fell. The originally noisy village seemed to have become quiet. Tian Tongshou opened his mouth slightly. His eyes were a little dazed. Is this guy crazy? Does he know what he is talking about? Become friends. What is this? I was almost beaten to death by him. Before he died, he asked if he wanted to be his friend. Crazy. This is something that even eight poles cannot defeat. I'm asking you something. Meng Chengqing waved his hand in front of him. Tian Tong's men subconsciously wanted to refuse. But Meng Chengqing's next words made him stop suddenly. If you don't want to, I can only seal your acupuncture points, forcibly extend your life for a while, and then throw you into the pile of monsters. The feeling of being slowly eaten, 
Must be nice, right? Gulu. Tian Tong Shou's face became paler. Is this a righteous disciple? It's simply more demon Dao than demon Dao. Crazy, absolutely crazy. Tian Tong Shou kept cursing in his heart. How come there are still people who force people to become his friends? In his mind, Meng Chengqing is already the kind of person with abnormal brain. I will. After calming down, Tian Tongshou still answered helplessly. Just be willing. Anyway, I won't lose anything, so I can graciously satisfy this crazy person's special hobby. Save yourself from having to suffer before you die. Ding. Add friends successfully. Current favorability. One star. Acquired attributes. Talent rough skin and thick flesh. Integrate immediately. The voice of the system sounded in my mind. A delighted smile suddenly appeared on Meng Chengqing's face. Good luck. Now that he has the talent, he is really afraid that it will be randomly assigned to other attributes. It's like this one-time friendship. Once the random error is made, it is impossible to get it again. After all, it is impossible for him to improve his favorability here with Tian Tong Shou. Thank you, my friend. In return, I'll make your death easier. Meng Chengqing patted Tian Tong Shou's shoulder with satisfaction. Then he formed a sword with two fingers and pointed it at the center of his eyebrows, and powerful energy and blood rushed in. His eyes instantly became distracted and his head dropped heavily. The breath is gone. The bandit leader who caused trouble for one party fell away. System, fusion talent, Meng Chengqing said in his heart. Ding, the fusion begins. The moment he finished speaking, Meng Chengqing felt a coldness emerge under his skin, like running water, gradually spreading throughout his body. About a moment later, this feeling completely subsided. As this talent rough skin and thick flesh, Meng Chengqing rolled up his sleeves. There are no particularly obvious changes in the thickness of the arms or skin color. It's just that when you poke this skin with your fingertips, you can clearly feel the resistance. It's like countless overlapping nets, extremely tough. Try the bronze armor technique again. Meng Chengqing started to run the exercises. The complexion suddenly resembled that of a bronze statue, filled with an aura of indestructibility. Bronze armor technique is just a human level high level body refining martial skill. But at this moment, with the increase in talent, there has obviously been a substantial improvement. It can definitely be compared to the profound level elementary body refining martial arts. The shortcomings in defense have been somewhat made up for. Meng Chengqing thought. And with this talent, no matter what body refining martial arts you practice in the future, you will be able to have more significant effects, far surpassing others. But for Meng Chengqing, what he wanted most was the stone human bloodline of the two brothers from the Xi family. That's what's truly awesome. Withdrawing his mind, Meng Chengqing took off the gloves from Tian Tong Shou and used them as proof. Consider that after all, he has benefited from him and is a nominal friend. Then a hole was dug. Buried it. Thinking that late autumn was approaching and the weather was slightly cold, Meng Chengqing deliberately covered the house with a few more layers of soil and stamped it firmly. It's worth it for you to have such a caring friend like me. After doing all this, Meng Chengqing turned around and left with satisfaction. Kill the heavenly bronze hand and the mission will be completed. As for the other bandits, none of them survived. The previous sword was driven with all his strength, and even Tian Tongshou did not dare to take it forcefully. Not to mention them. One by one died on the spot. Go home. Riding on the spirit horse, Meng Chengqing galloped away into the distance. Five days later, Yunshuichang, an ancient city built on the bank of a river. The population is approximately 100,000. Because of the convenient transportation, the daily flow of people is huge, which also makes the city's business quite prosperous. The Meng Chamber of Commerce is one of the large chambers of commerce in Yunshui City. Occupying several cities, quite famous. Of course, the most famous one is the president of the Meng Chamber of Commerce. A woman in a black skirt who always wears a hat, relies on her mysterious sword skills to become almost invincible in the aperture opening realm. That's why, the Meng Chamber of Commerce has been able to maintain its original status over the years and not be annexed by other chambers of commerce. Yunshui City has finally arrived. Looking at the huge ancient city looming in the distance, Meng Chengqing took a breath. At the same time, some inexplicable emotions emerged in my heart. 
because this will be the first time he truly faces his blood relatives in this world. Main Chamber of Commerce The residence is surrounded by a series of pavilions, connected to each other, with tall courtyard walls outside, which is quite impressive. At the gate, there are two guards from Meridian Forging Realm's seventh layer. It's just the way I remember it, nothing has changed. Looking at the station, Meng Chengqing nodded slightly. Are you, the young patriarch? A slightly uncertain voice sounded. Meng Chengqing followed the sound. I saw that one of the guards was already looking at me, with a surprised and uncertain expression on his face. The other guards also reacted. Um, Meng Chengqing nodded slightly. The imaginary cliché plot did not happen. It seems that in the family, the status of the young patriarch is indeed quite high. What a young patriarch! The two of them suddenly became excited. In the family, although the predecessor's talent was not the highest, his personality was the best. Usually these guards and servants are quite approachable. This also gave the predecessor an excellent reputation. Young patriarch, let me lead your horse. One person stepped forward quickly. The other person rushed in, running and shouting. The young patriarch is back. For a time, the Meng's residence, which had been somewhat quiet, suddenly became lively. Many tribesmen came out of the room one after another, including clan elders. After all, it has been two years since the young patriarch joined the Extreme Profundities sect. Not much news came back in two years. I don't know what the specific situation is. When Meng Chengqing stepped through the door, hundreds of pairs of eyes looked over. There is curiosity, joy, and different emotions. I've met the young patriarch. Soon, everyone congratulated. No need to be polite. Looking at the faces, Meng Chengqing did not feel as unfamiliar as expected. There is a sense of closeness in the blood. Chong Cheng. A voice of surprise sounded. Meng Chengqing saw the crowd in front of him split into two, and a black figure walked over quickly. Wearing a hat and a black skirt. The tall figure is well proportioned and full of mature charm. He is the president of the Meng Chamber of Commerce. That is Meng Chengqing's aunt. Ji Yu Hongyu. Auntie. Looking at the woman in black dress who was just a short distance away, Meng Chengqing couldn't help but smile on his face. This is the most important person in my memory to my predecessor. It can be seen from the instinct of the body. Instinctively close. Trust instinctively. If it weren't for this woman, he wouldn't have the life he has today. Young patriarch, join the extreme profundities sect. Everything will be just a fantasy. Good on you boy, finally willing to come back. Because Ji Yu Hongyu was wearing a bamboo hat with gauze hanging down around her, she couldn't see her face clearly, but she could hear the deep joy in her voice. As an outsider, she would choose to stay in Meng's family mainly because of Meng Changqing. Otherwise she would have left long ago. I thought you had forgotten about me, my aunt, and wanted to stay in Extreme Profundities sect for the rest of your life. Ji Yu Hongyu raised her hand and knocked on Meng Chengqing's chest, only to find that it was extra hard, unlike before. Auntie, I'm serious, if I forget anyone, I can't forget you. Meng Chengqing said with a smile. HMPH, I'm sorry you don't dare either. Ji Yu Hongyu hummed, then he reacted and coughed lightly. After all, there is a large crowd here, not alone in private. As the president, she still has to maintain a cold attitude. Young patriarch, your clothes seem to be something that only inner disciples of the extreme profundities sect are qualified to wear, right? A clan elder suddenly spoke up. Everyone's attention immediately fell on the clothes. As one of the major forces in Tianling state, people in the world will naturally know more about the situation of extreme profundities sect. Generally speaking, the clothes of outer disciples are relatively simple, while the clothes of inner disciples will have many patterns. Cloud pattern on cuffs, gold trim. As for true disciples who are further up, their clothes will be more noble and luxurious, and may even have some unique functions. It's really the clothes of an inner disciple. Doesn't that mean that the young patriarch is already an aperture opening realm martial artist? The words fell. The exclamations continued. Aperture opening realm. For people from a small place like them, they are already at a strong level. And he is also an inner disciple of Extreme Profundities sect. Although there is only one word difference between the outer door and the inner door, they are completely different from each other. Only by entering the inner gate can one be considered a formal disciple of the Extreme Profundities sect. Extreme Profundities sect. 
That's where they all dreamed of going. You, hearing this, Ji Yu Hong Yu immediately reacted. Yes, I am now an inner disciple, aperture opening realm fourth layer. Meng Chengqing nodded. A strong aura of cultivation suddenly emerged. Ji Yu Hong Yu's veil in front of her moved slightly, and a beautiful face flashed across her face. Aperture opening realm fourth layer. Everyone was shocked again. I thought that the young patriarch had just stepped into this realm, but he didn't expect that he had already gone a long way in this realm. The young patriarch is mighty. After a brief silence, cheers suddenly broke out. In Yunshui City, Aperture Opening Realm Martial Artist is the top floor. For the Meng family, having one more Aperture Opening Realm is tantamount to a great increase in strength. And how old is the young patriarch now? There is a great opportunity to set foot on sea opening in the future. Once you enter sea opening, you are truly transcendent, above the world. Good. Excitement also appeared in Ji Yu Hong Yu's voice. No wonder that when I knocked on his chest just now, he felt a bit abnormal and overbearing. It turns out that I have already gained a foothold. But deep down she still had doubts. She had watched Meng Chengqing grow up since she was a child, and she knew his situation very well, down to a hair's breadth, but it was not too far off. With his qualifications, he should not be able to set foot in the aperture opening realm in such a short period of time. It's just that the current situation is not suitable for further investigation. Let's check his body carefully at night. That night, after a sumptuous feast, Meng Chengqing was pulled into her room by Ji Yu Hongyu. Although my aunt is an elder, she is still a woman. The layout of its room is quite elegant. There is also a faint fragrance permeating the air, refreshing, just like the one on his body. Auntie, what's the matter? Meng Chengqing rubbed his face. It's a rare trip back, and toasts from some clan elders and clan members are unavoidable. But with his cultivation level, it was impossible to get drunk. It was just that after being on the road for a long time, he really wanted to go back to his room to rest. But as soon as I left, I was stopped by my aunt, and then I came here. Take off your clothes, Ji Yu Hong Yu said. Ah, Meng Chengqing was stunned and said, Auntie, we can't make ethical jokes. You boy. Ji Yu Hong Yu rolled her eyes, then tapped Meng Chengqing's head with her right hand, where are you thinking? Take off your clothes when I tell you to. All right. Meng Chengqing could only do as he was told. He doesn't have to listen to what others say, or even ignore it, but that's a different matter for his aunt. As the clothes come off, Meng Chengqing's perfect upper body was also on display. Although it does not have explosive muscles, it has sharp edges and corners, fullness and artistic beauty. Even Ji Yu Hongyu was stunned. But with the veil covering her face, Meng Chengqing couldn't see her expression. She was stunned for only a moment, but Ji Yu Hongyu quickly came to her senses. She coughed lightly and then said, Stand still. The words fell. Ji Yu Hongyu was seen making seals with both hands. Extremely fast. Finally, he slapped Meng Chengqing on the chest. In an instant, a lotus flower pattern appeared under the skin of his chest. The lotus is white and pure, seemingly spotless. Seeing this, Ji Yu Hong Yu breathed a sigh of relief, and at the same time retracted her hand and took off her hat. It's hard to describe how beautiful this face is. The skin is like gelatin and can be broken by a blow. The eyes are more like autumn water, the waves are flowing, attracting people's attention. Meng Chengqing once guessed why Ji Yu Hong Yu always wore a hat. He thought it was because his appearance was too prominent to prevent others from coveting her, but later it turned out that was not the case. There seems to be another hidden agenda. Auntie, what is this? Meng Chengqing was a little puzzled. It's a means of detecting magic power. Ji Yu Hong Yu said casually, I still know your qualifications. Under normal circumstances, it is absolutely impossible to gain access to the orifice in two years. Fortunately, you didn't take shortcuts and practice magic skills. Auntie, you don't believe me too much. Meng Chengqing didn't know whether to laugh or cry. No wonder he was asked to take off his clothes when he came in, thinking that he was practicing magic skills. I've been away from home for two years and I'm not around, so who knows? Ji Yu Hongyu relaxed, wrinkled her beautiful nose, and crossed her arms across her chest. She is actually not much older than Meng Chengqing. Now he is only 30. Maybe it's natural beauty. Or maybe it was properly maintained. 
There are no traces of time on her body, only the charm of maturity. Then what if I really have to practice magic skills? Meng Chengqing looked at her with a somewhat incomprehensible tone. Ji Yu Hong Yu raised her eyebrows slightly and looked at Meng Chengqing. There were no words for a long time. Finally she shrugged. What else can be done? I have worked so hard to raise you, is it possible that I want to be a guardian of justice and kill you with my own hands? Of course it's okay to make mistakes. Hear the words. Meng Chengqing smiled. He is indeed the most important person to him. Will always choose to be on his side, right or wrong. Don't worry, auntie, I have Kang Zhuang Great Dao, there is no need to follow the path of Demon Dao. Meng Chengqing said softly, the progress of cultivation is so fast, mainly because of opportunities. Um, Ji Yu Hong Yu nodded, although your qualifications are ordinary, in martial Dao practice, qualifications are not absolute, and luck is also a key factor. It seems like you have some luck, kid. How come it wasn't reflected before? Maybe it's not the time yet. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly. At the same time, the exploratory eyes were opened. I was surrounded by tribesmen before, so I didn't have time to observe my aunt's character attributes. Now I finally have time. In his memory, his aunt was very mysterious, as if she was shrouded in mist. Buzz, like water flowing across it. Next to Ji Yu Hong Yu, her character attributes emerged. Basic information. Name, Ji Yu Hong Yu. Race, human race. Cultivation, aperture opening realm seventh layer tentative. Property information, root bone. Second grade, damage. Comprehension, superior. Talent. Spiritual eyes blocked. Kung Fu and martial arts. Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra, perfection. Secret technique. Palm Lotus suppression magic. Seeing this, Meng Chengqing clenched his hands and tried hard to keep his expression from changing. There was an uproar inside. This panel is too luxurious. He had only seen such a luxurious panel on that girl by Suxi. Only the genius among geniuses can possess it. I didn't expect my aunt to be the same. But unlike Bai Suxi, many of Auntie's attributes have suffixes after them. For example, the one after cultivation, tentative. What does it mean? The realm of cultivation is something that is so clear at a glance, it is what it is, why is it temporarily determined? Could it be that my aunt was once very high, but has she fallen to this point? And root bone. This is second grade root bone, the same as Bai Suxi. Even now that he has entered the inner gate, he has not seen anyone else. You can see how rare it is. Of course, that's not to say that Extreme Profundity's sect doesn't have this level of genius. It's just that he hasn't encountered it now. After all, there are true inheritances and so on above the inner gate. What he has glimpsed and come into contact with so far is just the tip of the iceberg of Extreme Profundity's sect. Root bone is the most important thing for a martial artist. Once it is broken, there is no way to improve your cultivation. There is also the talent, spiritual eyes, which is also blocked. Taken together, Auntie is obviously ruined. It seems that my aunt's past is really not simple. Meng Chengqing couldn't help but think. If someone with qualifications like my aunt were placed in the extreme profundities sect, even the peak master would probably come out of seclusion personally and accept her as a disciple. But now it is abolished. You can only live in such a remote place. In addition, the aunt is the mother's junior sister, which means that the mother's qualifications should not be worse than the aunt. Good guy. Thinking about it carefully, the force that my aunt once belonged to must be at least the level of extreme profundity sect. Auntie, although I am naturally beautiful and approachable, you don't have to be so fascinated by me. While Meng Chengqing was thinking, Ji Yu Hong Yu spoke. Meng Chengqing came to his senses immediately. But he saw Ji Yu Hong Yu looking at him with some amusement. In public, my aunt is still very serious, but in private she is a bit bold and open. Especially when you're with him. I remember ten years ago, when I was about seven years old, I even took a bath in a tub. No taboos. Perhaps in this strange Meng family, aunt can only truly relax when she gets along with him. I was just wondering when my aunt would be able to tell me about my parents. Meng Chengqing put on his clothes and said slowly. In his memory, he had no impression of his biological father and mother. It seems that not long after they were born, the two died. 
Hearing this, Ji Yu Hongyu's complexion changed slightly, but soon became normal. In the future, I will tell you when the time comes. Ji Yu Hongyu took a deep breath, her eyes a little complicated. Good. Meng Chengqing did not ask further questions. Because my aunt is very strict in this aspect and can't ask anything at all. Then let's talk about something else. Meng Chengqing raised the corners of his mouth slightly. Although my aunt has been crippled, the attributes on the panel are real. It made him very greedy. Comprehension, talent, martial arts, etc. What to talk about? Ji Yu Hongyu did not expect that Meng Chengqing would change the topic so quickly. In the past, it would have taken a long time to ask. We are not related by blood as aunts and grandsons, right? Meng Chengqing said, certainly. Then can we establish another relationship besides this relationship? Meng Chengqing has some expectations. Don't you think, this is not good? You can't make ethical jokes. Ji Yu Hongyu said jokingly. Where did you think you were? Meng Chengqing was speechless. What he said just now was counterattacked by him. So what relationship do you want to have? Ji Yu Hongyu took a step forward and raised her brows slightly. She has a slim figure and a well-proportioned figure, and every move she makes exudes the charm of a mature woman. Especially the faint body fragrance. Really fascinating. Friend, Meng Chengqing has long been accustomed to Ji Yu Hongyu's way of getting along, so he doesn't have any unnecessary distractions. Besides, his attention was on the panel. Quote question mark question mark question mark quote. Ji Yu Hongyu was stunned. She had thought about it a lot, but never thought of this. What are friends? You're such a young boy, you actually want to be my equal. After reacting, Ji Yu Hongyu immediately put her hands on her hips, her chest rising and falling. I can't explain the specifics. Anyway, Auntie, just promise to be my friend. After all, he is the person closest to him at present, and Meng Chengqing is too lazy to spend time making up some reasons. I believe my aunt will agree. All right. Although this request was indeed strange, seeing Meng Chengqing's serious expression, Ji Yu Hongyu frowned and agreed. Anyway, it's all spoken privately. No impact. But after two years away from home, this kid may have developed some weird hobbies. Who wants to make friends with elders? No matter how you think about it, it is outrageous. Ding. Add friends successfully. Current favorability. Four stars. Get attributes. Comprehension. Superior. Talent. Spiritual eyes. Martial arts. Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra. Perfect. Secret technique. Palm Lotus Suppression Magic. In my mind, the voice of the system kept ringing. It's a surprise that Meng Chengqing's mental quality is too high, otherwise he would have shouted out immediately. I just added a friend, and my favorability level has reached four stars. Obtained four attributes in a row. But if you think about it carefully, it's normal. After all, my aunt is not just a random stranger. She has grown up with her and has a high opinion of her, which is very reasonable. The system's favorability limit seems to be five stars. Four stars is already very, very high. At least none of my current friends have such a high profile. The highest is only two stars. Thank you, auntie. Taking a deep breath, Meng Chengqing suppressed his excitement and said, it's already dark, so I won't disturb your rest. Finished. Meng Chengqing turned and left. He can't wait to merge attributes. The door was wide open, and the bright moonlight, like running water, slowly flowed into the house. Ji Yu Hongyu stood there. Somewhat unclear. She didn't even know what Meng Chengqing was excited about. Are you so happy to agree to be his friend? Does this kid really have any ideas beyond ethics? Ji Yu Hongyu couldn't help thinking. Become friends first, slowly fade away the past relationship between aunt and grandson, and then gradually develop in that direction. If it was a real great aunt, then all this would be impossible. But there is no blood relationship between himself and Meng Chengqing after all. Sister's son, raised from a baby. Ji Yu Hongyu trembled all over and quickly put away this terrible thought. But then again, as he grows older, this boy is indeed becoming more and more handsome, much like his senior sister. Plus those perfect muscles. It's really manly. Bang bang. Feeling that she couldn't control her thoughts, Ji Yu Hongyu patted her face and woke up completely. Finally something seemed to come to mind. It turned into a sigh. I saw her looking at the moonlight outside the window and speaking quietly. 
senior sister, Chong Ching, although his qualifications are average, but now it seems that he has some luck. There may be certain achievements on Marshall Dao in the future. But there's no way it can compete with that behemoth. Actually, I still hope that he can remain ordinary and at least be able to spend his life peacefully. You don't have to face it. Return to your residence. Meng Chengqing closed the door and sat cross-legged on the bed. At the same time, the character panel was brought up. Basic information. Name. Meng Chengqing. Opening square bracket dot 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 closing square bracket. Property information. Root bone. Second grade. Comprehension. Average. Talent. Skillful hands, rough skin and thick flesh. Kung Fu and martial arts. Wind and thunder sword technique. Completed. Friends. Sha Han. Bai Suxi, Qin Fang, Tian Tongshou, Ji Yu Hongyu, Tip, click on the friend to view more information. Unfused Attributes, Superior Understanding, Spiritual Vision, Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra, Palm Lotus Suppressing Magic. Making a Fortune, Meng Chengqing looked excited. However, at the first moment, I still noticed some changes in the panel. For example, in the friends column, there are additional prompts. What's this? Following the prompts, Meng Chengqing clicked on Sha Han. Its character panel suddenly appeared. There is Sha Han's avatar on it, as well as various attributes. Friend. Sha Han. Race. Human race. Cultivation. Aperture opening realm first layer. Opening square bracket dot 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 closing square bracket. Aperture opening realm. Meng Chengqing nodded slightly. Sha Han was already a meridian forging realm ninth layer before. With the recovery pills he gave her, it was reasonable for her to achieve a breakthrough after such a long time. Wait, doesn't this mean? Meng Chengqing's eyes lit up. If you can check your friend's information in this way, you don't need to meet face to face. And you can also know the status of your friends. Have you become stronger? Have you learned something new? Thinking, Meng Chengqing clicked on Bai Suxi's panel again. Friend, Bai Suxi, race, human race. Cultivation. Aperture opening realm second layer. Opening square bracket dot 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 closing square bracket. Kung Fu and martial arts skills. Origin returning Kung Fu of the underworld. First level wind and thunder sword technique. Small success. As expected, I have gained a lot of knowledge, and I am already in the second layer realm. I have also learned the wind and thunder sword technique. Then I should be like me and worship entering spirit Zalfang. He was not surprised at all by Bai Suxi's breakthrough. That girl's qualifications are the same as those of her aunt, and the key is excellent luck. When being chased by a demon wolf, I met him and came to the rescue. After that, the injury improved, and when I went out, I could still encounter you on Ling Grass. No matter how you think about it, it feels outrageous. I have to hurry up and practice, otherwise it won't take long and I'm afraid I'll be caught up by this girl. Meng Chengqing chuckled. It's not that he was slacking off, it was mainly because he didn't have any powerful resources while rushing home. It's just that you can't increase your cultivation level. But things will be back to normal starting tomorrow. With the family background, it can at least satisfy his needs to go to the sea opening realm. By the way, what is this, origin returning skill? I remember that this skill was not on by Suxi's panel before, nor was it included in Ling Xiao Peak's initial martial arts. So this should be obtained by Bai Suxi from other sources. This name sounds very powerful. It is definitely not an ordinary skill. After we go back, let's see if we can continue to improve our favorability. Meng Chengqing thought so. Then he dispersed his distracting thoughts and began to focus on what he had gained this time. System, four attributes, integrated one by one. Ding, the fusion begins. The first attribute is superior understanding. Bai Suxi also has a high level of understanding, but it's a pity that she didn't get it from her before. She originally wanted to slowly figure it out in the future. After all, understanding is also very important. Especially in the late stage of practice, it is said that if you want to break through to a great realm, you cannot rely solely on resources, but you must also understand the true meaning of martial Dao. Unexpectedly, I got it in advance from my aunt. With the fusion of superior understanding, Meng Chengqing felt that the spiritual platform was empty and the dust had dispersed, and his thinking became extremely clear. Some of the doubts I had about spiritual practice in the past have answers at this moment. 
Draw inferences from one instance and draw inferences by analogy. Good. Meng Chengqing nodded slightly. In this way, even if he lacks the martial technique attainment card in the future, he can still learn martial arts skills with his understanding. Without waiting, Meng Chengqing felt the specific changes brought about by superior understanding. The fusion of the second attribute begins. Talent, spiritual eyes. Meng Chengqing felt that his eyes were instantly enveloped by warm and cool water. This feeling was not painful, on the contrary, it was very pleasant. It's like bathing in the spring sun. The fusion of talents this time took much longer than before. Meng Chengqing also waited patiently. It wasn't completely over until half an hour later. Spirit Eye Meng Chengqing opened his eyes, but saw light flowing in them. The originally dark environment also became brighter, not to mention like daylight, but not far away. The Power of Night Vision Meng Chengqing looked around, feeling quite satisfied. With this spiritual eye, even if you are fighting at night, you don't have to worry about vision problems. And this is only the most basic ability of the spiritual eye. Its strongest effect is to see shattering void delirium. In short, illusion formations and the like are of no use to him. Can directly see the essence. This talent is much better than dexterity and rough skin. Meng Chengqing commented. No wonder the integration time takes so long. Soon the third attribute began. Martial Arts. Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra. To be honest, Meng Chengqing had some impressions of this name, or some of the words in it, as if he had seen it somewhere. But I can't remember the specifics. Wow, a huge amount of information flooded into my mind. It is even denser than the previous, Wind and Thunder Sword Art. It took a moment to absorb it all. It's actually a profound level advanced martial art. Meng Chengqing took a breath of cold air. Profound level is already very precious at the beginning. What's more, it's a high-end one. Even if it is the inner door of extreme profundities sect, not everyone is qualified to learn it. Located a few floors above the hidden martial pavilions. A large amount of contribution points are required to redeem. And places like Yunshuicheng, not at all. The highest martial skill is the profound level. It is regarded as a family heirloom by the Great Chamber of Commerce. You can see the rarity. And starting from the profound level, the difficulty of practicing martial arts becomes extremely high. It can be said that it is rank 1 first layer day. Without excellent qualifications, resources, and understanding, even if you get it, you won't be able to practice it. As for the earth level above the profound level, it was almost audible and invisible. Only when you get to the core of the sect can you be qualified to contact them. I have achieved perfect attainment in this martial arts. I have almost no rivals in the aperture opening realm, even if my realm is only fourth layer. Meng Chengqing raised the corners of his mouth slightly. Just the perfect attainment of profound level high level martial arts is enough to surpass everyone. What's more, he also has sword steps, sword power and other amplifying powers. Just imagining it is a bit too strong. The Linglong Cold Moon Sword Sutra takes the meaning of the cold winter moon. The sword style is so chilling that the world is cold and frozen for thousands of miles. Sure enough, the higher the level of martial arts, the higher the ambition. Meng Chengqing kept rehearsing sword postures in his mind. The more you practice, the more terrifying you feel about this sword technique. Because the sword moves are too subtle. Each sword can be struck from incredible angles. In addition, in conjunction with its hard meridian technique, it can also turn the burning chi and blood in the body into icy cold chi. It affects the surrounding environment. The stronger the strength, the wider the scope. It can even freeze people directly into ice sculptures. Destroy vitality. This is just the stimulation of chi and blood. When the sea opening realm is reached and Danhai gives birth to true chi, its power is truly terrifying. Each sword can cut out the substantial cold moon sword light. Sweep the battlefield. After thinking about it, the last attribute also began to merge. Secret technique. Palm lotus suppressing magic. This is not a martial skill, but a secret technique, specifically used to detect demonic power and suppress demonic energy. It's a side skill, and it will have good results in dealing with demon Dao martial artist. That's all. All four attributes are finally integrated. Meng Chengqing also fell back and lay on the bed. Although his cultivation level has not improved at all, his overall strength has been greatly enhanced. By the way, there's one more thing. 
As if thinking of something, Meng Chengqing continued to click on the friend's column. To be precise, it's the heavenly bronze hand. Unlike the others, the head of the celestial bronze hand is gray. This made Meng Chengqing think of something. Your gray avatar will no longer jump. Tip. When a friend dies, the avatar will be gray, indicating that the friend is offline. The system suddenly said, as expected, Meng Chengqing nodded. In this case, I can only delete you from my friend list. Click, select, and delete. The process is similar to the previous life. There is still a sense of familiarity and immersion. After doing all this, Meng Chengqing removed the panel, closed his eyes and began to take a formal rest. The journey during this period was quite tiring. The next day, breaking dawn, the sky is filled with glow. Meng Chengqing took a rare nap and didn't get up from bed until noon. No one bothered him during this period, including Ji Yu Hongyu. Open the door. The warm sunshine suddenly shone in. Meng Chengqing stood naked in the sun. I saw him stretching his body, and there was a crackling sound of bones in his body. If you listen carefully, there is even a hint of tiger and leopard thunder. Only a tyrannical body can move like this. Um. Meng Chengqing suddenly raised his eyebrows slightly. Because he found a person standing not far from the door. He is from the Meng family. At this time, he was looking at him in stunned silence. When she noticed his gaze, she suddenly woke up. Young patriarch, you're awake. The female clansman quickly bowed and saluted, with a few blushes appearing on her lowered cheeks. Oh my god, is this the body of the young patriarch? It's too strong. Even standing at this slightly distant position, you can still feel the hot energy and blood in his body. Like a blazing fire, full of oppression. Um, Meng Chengqing nodded, then picked up the clothes next to him and put them on. When the strong body is covered, he was back to his usual self. There was no wind or rain, it was peaceful and quiet, full of youthful feeling. He looks like a handsome young man from aristocratic family. The female tribe member rubbed her eyes. This painting style has changed a lot. But whether it was the young patriarch just now or the current one, she liked him very much. Is there a problem? Meng Chengqing walked over with a gentle voice. The president asked me to wait here and said that when you wake up, go to the family hall to look for her. The female tribe member quickly answered. Okay, I understand, thank you for your hard work, go down first. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly. Yes, the female tribe members immediately left respectfully. After the female tribe members left, Meng Chengqing tidied up a little and walked towards the family hall. My aunt is a very smart person. He must have known the purpose of returning to his family. Family Hall When Meng Chengqing came here, Ji Yu Hongyu was sitting on the main seat, drinking tea and reading miscellaneous books. If you don't come over, I'll go to your room and check your breathing. Ji Yu Hongyu put down the book and said slowly, It's rare to have time to rest. Meng Chengqing walked over to her and sat down. Pour yourself a cup of tea. 2. Ji Yu Hongyu nodded and then pushed a jade box in front of Meng Chengqing, here are second-grade Lingrong pills. There are ten pills in total, suitable for the cultivation of Aperture Opening Realm martial artist. It was originally prepared for the two clan elders. But it's yours now, Lingrong Dan. Meng Chengqing reached out and took it. As the son of the Chamber of Commerce, he naturally knows some of the pills on the market. Once the elixir enters the grade, the price is relatively high, let alone the second grade. Among the second grade elixirs, this Lingrong pill is also quite precious because it is very effective and can be taken multiple times. Unlike other elixirs, only the first time has the best effect, and it will get lower and lower in the future, which is the so called drug resistance. The ordinary aperture opening realm simply cannot afford such elixirs. Most of them are even using first grade. Only big families and big chambers of commerce can have such strength. Elders, don't you have any objections? Meng Chengqing is not open. They asked for it. Ji Yu Hongyu smiled and shook her head. In their words, they are old and have ordinary qualifications. Although they take this pill, their cultivation will be improved. But it's definitely not obvious. It's a waste of natural resources. And you are now the future of the Meng family, so naturally we will devote all our resources to you. Good. Meng Chengqing didn't say anything more. He just remembered it in his heart. These ten Lingrong pills are probably one-seventh of the family's heritage. After all, 
Ling Rong Dan is very precious. And with his current root bone quality, these 10 spiritual fusion pills should be able to almost reach aperture opening realm 7th layer. The higher the quality of root bone, the higher the absorption speed and absorption rate of the elixir. Not too much is wasted. In the past, not to mention 10 pills, even 40 pills wouldn't be of much use. The speed is slow and the absorption rate is still low. You shouldn't be in a hurry to return to the sect. I will send people out to purchase various resources in the next two days. After all, you came back too suddenly, and you weren't prepared for many things. Ji Yu Hong Yu said, I can only stay for five or six days. Meng Chengqing answered, so anxious, Ji Yu Hong Yu was a little surprised. Um, then Meng Chengqing told her about Secret Realm. I see, Ji Yu Hong Yu suddenly realized, then you really need to hurry back. Secret Realm belongs to the Grotto Heaven. It is a place of good fortune. There are too many good things. Anything you get can improve your strength. Seeing Ji Yu Hong Yu's reaction, Meng Chengqing became more certain of his previous suspicion. If it were anyone else, they would have been excited when they heard the word Secret Realm. But my aunt was relatively calm. Not many ups and downs. This will only happen if you see it too much. Let's do this. I will step up my supervision and have it ready for you in five days. Ji Yu Hong Yu said, Thank you very much, Auntie. After two years of absence, I have become a bit more mature. Ji Yu Hong Yu rolled her eyes and said, Thank you at all times. It's a family that has nothing to thank you for. You are now the backbone of the Meng family, and you will most likely be able to set foot in sea opening and transcendent in the future. All the resources of the family belong to you. Hear the words. Meng Chengqing could only stroke his forehead lightly. This is the truth, but this can be regarded as his habit. Gratitude must be thanked and hatred must be avenged. Let's do this for now. You've had a good rest these two days. I have to prepare some things for you myself. After saying that, Ji Yu Hong Yu stood up and left. Only Meng Chengqing was left sitting in the family hall. That's the good thing about family. At least you don't have to fight for training resources. As long as you are good enough, everything will come to you. An independent cultivator, why is it so difficult to have an extremely strong person? Apart from innate qualifications, it is also because too much time is wasted on searching for resources. But people like him can stay in their rooms quietly and practice all day long. What you want is what you want. Practice. Picking up the jade box, Meng Chengqing stood up and left the hall. My cultivation has been stagnant for so many days, and it's time to continue improving. In more than a month, the sect secret realm will be opened. Let's see if we can improve it to a few more realms. With the Taishuan Seven Meridians gathering together, the competition will definitely be extremely fierce. He will not underestimate himself, let alone others, especially the real geniuses in the inner sect. If you can't make friendly friends with them, you can only rely on the sword in your hand, no, it's your noble character and unparalleled charm. Yunshui Chang, under the active guidance of the Meng family. The news about his young master Meng Chengqing's breakthrough to Tongqing and promotion to the Taishuan inner sect has spread completely. This caused other chambers of commerce to be shaken. After all, being an aperture opening realm, or being such a young aperture opening realm, means something that is self-evident. For a time, the status of the Meng Chamber of Commerce in the city rose sharply. It is almost the trend of Yunshui No. 1 Chamber of Commerce. When the Meng family members go out, they all hold their heads high. Time flies. Five days later, outside Yunshui City, Ji Yu Hongyu was alone and sent Meng Chengqing to a grassy slope. In fact, the rest of the Meng family also wanted to follow. But they were all stopped by Ji Yu Hongyu. Auntie, just send it here. Meng Chengqing pulled the reins and said with a smile. Okay. Ji Yu Hongyu nodded. The grassy slope below is quite high, and the view is quite good. In the distance, you can see the rolling mountains and the surging river. This is the gift ring. Everything has been prepared for you and placed inside. Looking back, Ji Yu Hongyu took off the ring on her hand. The ring of holding things. Meng Chengqing's eyes moved slightly. This thing is a rarity. The price is extremely high. Contains small space for placing items. Generally speaking, the gift ring requires true qi to be used, which is sea opening realm martial artist. 
but after seeing it in the outer sect elder Sun Haishin, he changed his mind. After all, Sun Haishin is just an aperture opening realm martial artist, but he can use it. This gift ring is special. It contains the true chi of the predecessors, so you can use it even if you are not see opening. Ji Yu Hong Yu seemed to notice Meng Chengqing's surprise and explained. I see. Meng Chengqing suddenly realized. No wonder Sun Haishin can be used. With this storage ring, it will be much more convenient to travel in the future. Whether it is valuables or sundries, you can put it in it. Access anytime, anywhere. But as far as he knew, there didn't seem to be such a thing in the family. It probably belongs to my aunt. I gave him my own directly. My heart was suddenly touched. The world of spiritual practice is actually full of intrigues. Such sincerity is very rare. In addition, I will give you a good gift. Ji Yu Hong Yu took out a box from behind her. There was a seal on the box, which seemed to be very valuable. What's this? Meng Chengqing was a little curious. Baby, don't open it for now. Open it again when you get to the sea opening realm. Ji Yu Hong Yu said, in addition, don't pass on the contents inside to others. There was some seriousness in his words. Are you so cautious? Okay. Meng Chengqing didn't think much about it. Although my aunt sometimes speaks out of tune, if she is serious, it is true. I bit my finger and took the blood out of the ring to identify its owner, and a magical feeling suddenly appeared. It's as if one's own consciousness is connected with the ring of holding things. With just a thought, you can see the things in the ring and take them out easily. Then I'm leaving, aunt. Putting the sealed box into the storage ring, Meng Chengqing looked at Ji Yu Hong Yu and said. Come on, hurry up, come back, you will sweep away my mother's coffin. Ji Yu Hong Yu crossed her arms with disgust in her voice. Hear the words, Meng Chengqing suddenly smiled dumbly. He knew that what his aunt said was ironic. Once I leave, I don't know when I will come back again. After all, there is no time to practice. Thinking. He took a step forward and gently hugged Ji Yu Hong Yu. It was obvious that Ji Yu Hong Yu's body froze slightly, but she quickly returned to normal. He also hugged Meng Chengqing back. A gentle breeze blows, and the grass blades fly. The warm sunshine falls. The scene of the two embracing each other was actually somewhat beautiful. Although I don't know what your past is, Auntie, I will grow up to the day when you take the initiative to tell me. The sky and the earth are vast, listen to the dragon's roar. Meng Chengqing spoke softly in Ji Yu Hong Yu's ear. Then he let go of his hand, mounted the spirit horse, and galloped away into the distance. Only Ji Yu Hong Yu was still standing there. After a while, he came back to his senses. A helpless and relieved smile suddenly appeared on her beautiful face. This boy, it's really getting bolder. Ji Yu Hong Yu shook her head slightly, but kept looking at Meng Chengqing's retreating back. Senior sister, do you think we can hear the roar of the dragon? The wind in the plains rises again. The blowing on her hair was just like her heart, which was no longer calm. A few more days passed. Jufeng Ridge, located on the way back to Zongmen from Meng Chengqing. In fact, Meng Chengqing can still stay in the family for more than 10 days. But he didn't want to be too stuck on time. If something unexpected happens and we are delayed, it will be a big loss. Night falls. Meng Chengqing sat cross-legged under an ancient tree, with a flame burning in front of him, casting many lights and shadows on his face. The two-and-a-half-year-old horse stood not far away and fell asleep. The next second, Meng Chengqing suddenly opened his eyes. A very strong aura emerged from the body. Amazingly its aperture opening realm fifth layer. Breakthrough. Meng Chengqing took a breath. The effect of this Lingrong pill is indeed real. Just two of them allowed him to break through the first layer realm. But according to his estimation, it seems that the ten spirit fusion pills will not reach the eighth layer realm. Because the further the realm goes, the more it needs to be consumed. But it doesn't matter, there are still elixirs in the Nuwu ring, and my aunt has prepared a lot. According to Meng Chengqing, my aunt was afraid that she would give him half of the family's wealth. Anyway, cultivating to the aperture opening realm is more than enough. Boom. Just as Meng Chengqing was about to continue practicing, a firework lit up in the night sky in the distance. It turned into the word, Tai Zan. This is, Meng Chengqing stood up suddenly. Signal for help. This is a thing specially made by the sect to ask for help. 
Once it blooms, it can last for a long time in the air. Make people notice, or any extreme profundities sect disciples in danger. Meng Chengqing frowned slightly. If it were anywhere else, he would understand. But the Jufang Ridge below is already relatively close to the sect's territory. Who dares to attack the disciples of extreme profundities sect in a place like this? Don't want to die. Shaking his head slightly, Meng Chengqing didn't think much, he just woke up the sleeping spirit horse and rushed towards the place where the fireworks bloomed. No matter what, go and take a look first, and if you can, help yourself. After all, they belong to the same force. But if it goes beyond that, he can only choose to retreat. Chapter 31 Deep in Jufang Ridge, there are many ancient trees with lush leaves. Only the faint moonlight shines through the gap, leaving some light. At this moment, there are many black shadows standing on the branches, about twenty people. All of them smell good. The weakest one also looks like Meridian Forging Realm Sixth Layer. There are even five Aperture Opening Realms among them. Especially the one at the head. The aura is extremely terrifying, it is actually the pinnacle of the ninth layer. All the shadows are wearing similar clothes. Dark green in color. There is also the word, Yellow Spring, behind it. The forest at night was already eerie, and their presence made this feeling even stronger. The people surrounded by them were the disciples of Extreme Profundities sect, and they were inner disciples. Three in total, surprisingly, they are all women, ranging in age from older to younger. The clothes on his body are easy to identify. He is one of the seven Taishuan meridians and a disciple of Yao Wang Peak. The three of them were in very bad shape. All of them looked pale, with blood bleeding from the corners of their mouths, and their breath was very weak. He was obviously seriously injured. Netherworld Demon Sect. One of them gritted his silver teeth and said bitterly. But I saw that his face was beautiful and his skin was as white as snow. The level of cultivation is not low either, it is Aperture Opening Realm 7th Layer. You actually dare to come near our sect and attack and kill the disciples. Don't even think about leaving alive. Although he is no match for this group of demon Dao martial artists, a call for help has been issued and he believes that support will arrive soon. As a disciple of the sect, even if you may face poisonous hands, you must not be timid. I didn't expect that you actually had a secret body protecting weapon on you, which blocked the killer move for you. Otherwise, it would be impossible to issue this request for help. The leader, Demon Dao martial artist, took a few steps forward and his whole body was exposed to the fine moonlight. I saw that he was thin, with extremely long fingers, and a ferocious cross scar on his face. You are Chang Guijibei. The female disciple's name was Kong Linzu. She seemed to have thought of something and her pupils shrank slightly. Demon Dao martial artist, everyone gets it and kills it. However, Demon Dao martial artists are basically relatively strong and good at hiding, so it is extremely difficult to kill them. So much so that those who can still survive are hunted by many forces. He gradually gained fame. For example, the ghost in front of me points to Chank North. Origin Netherworld Demon Sect, he has mastered an elementary fingering martial art at the profound level, and his moves are extremely cunning and sinister, like something from the Netherworld, with terrifying penetrating power. Even wearing armor has no effect. The fact that she is alive now depends on the secret protective weapon given by her master, which is not comparable to ordinary armor. It's quite discerning. The corners of Bei Chenki's mouth raised slightly, making the scars on his face look even more ferocious. Ah, suddenly there was a scream. But not far away, there was a flash of light, which turned out to be a formation. In the formation, there are several Taoist figures kneeling. Judging from his clothes, he is also a disciple of Extreme Profundity's sect. The screams were caused by them. It can be seen with the naked eye that as the formation operates, blood mist is constantly filling the bodies of these disciples and converging towards the center. Transformed into pill form, blood refining array. You are actually practicing the Wangquan Shengqiao pill. Kong Linzu's pupils shrank, and a deep chill ran down her spine. This is the evil magic of Demon Dao. Using human essence and blood as the main component, combined with many materials, the elixir is refined. The better the qualifications, the higher the success rate and the stronger the medicine. Therefore, Demon Dao martial artist, who is good at this art, often captures powerful geniuses to make elixirs. 
Wangquan Shengqiao pill is also called human blood pill. Kong Linzu understood immediately. Why does this northern Chang dare to come near extreme profundities sect? It turned out that I had mastered this evil magic. Among the second grade elixirs, Wangquan Shengqiao Dan can be said to be one of the most effective elixirs. After all, the essence and blood of the genius are used as the main medicine. But this is witchcraft after all. The side effects are huge. It will affect the user's spirit, making them irritable and dry, and they will go crazy if used too much. Sir, we need to evacuate as soon as possible. Support from extreme profundities sect should be coming soon. A martial artist next to him stepped forward and said respectfully. Although he is also an aperture opening realm, he only has a third layer, which is completely incomparable with a martial artist like Kita Sank. So he became a subordinate. Wait a little longer, the human blood pill will be almost completed. Bei Chang thought for a while and said. These extreme profundities sect disciples in the formation have good qualifications, and there is a high probability that they can become elixirs. He didn't want to give up at this critical moment. Get these three people and use them as materials for the next round. Bei Cheng glanced at Kong Linzu indifferently. The three of them suddenly fell into an ice cellar. Yes, but at this moment, Bei Cheng suddenly frowned, turned around suddenly, raised his head, and looked at an ancient tree. I didn't expect someone to come. Your Excellency, please come out. I've found you. The words fell. All eyes looked there together. All I saw was darkness. A silhouette slowly revealed its figure. It was Meng Chengcheng. In fact, he had just arrived, and he only heard about the ghost guide Bei Cheng and the blood refining array. When counting the number of people on the field, he was discovered the next second. It seems that I have to learn a secret technique of concealing aura in the future. Otherwise, it will be easy to show your weakness. As expected, he is a disciple of Extreme Profundities sect. Bei Chengki's eyes turned cold. However, when he realized that the newcomer's cultivation level was only Aperture Opening Realm 5th layer, his brows widened again. A disciple with this level of cultivation is not threatening in any way. He doesn't even need to take action, just his four subordinates can solve it. Get him. Bei Cheng turned around. Yes. The four men immediately rushed towards Meng Changcheng. Junior brother, run quickly. You are no match for them. Go to the sect and ask for help. When someone came, Kong Linzu was still very surprised, but when she discovered the person's cultivation level, her heart suddenly sank. Even her aperture opening realm seventh layer is no match. Not to mention fifth layer. So decisive. Meng Changcheng raised his eyebrows slightly as he looked at the four demon Dao approaching at high speed. But this is exactly what he wants, so he should solve it as soon as possible. For him, as long as there is no sea opening realm on the field, he is invincible. What about Demon Dao martial artist? Unless you are a genius from a big force at apex level, you can't stop his sword. Boy, give me your head. The four of them were very fast, and in a few blinks of an eye, they had already arrived in front of Meng Chengcheng. All weapons used are knives. The sword was so cold that it slashed hard at the vital parts of Meng Chengqing's body. If he is hit, he will be seriously injured even if he is not dead. Well done. Meng Chengqing's eyes showed fighting spirit. To be honest, he quite wanted to have such a battle. To test your limits. If only they could do it. Rub. Meng Chengqing pulled out the sword from his waist. The sword this time was no longer the ordinary one before, but a hundred refined sword specially purchased by the family enough to withstand his power. It won't break after just one use. Wind and thunder sword technique. The blood is surging. A bright thunder light lit up from the sword. It was also reflected in the eyes of the four people. It can be clearly seen that the cruel smiles of the four people suddenly froze, and then there was a look of fear. Because this sword is like thunder roaring from the sky and roaring wind. The smell is terrifying. There is no way they can resist it. But at this moment, they were already in a small area and had no time to dodge, so they had no choice but to fight hard. Boom! With a sword slashed out, the brilliant lightning seemed to be able to crush everything. The four long knives shattered instantly. The user also flew backwards, hit the ground hard, and rolled several times before he could stop. He was bleeding all over his body and was already seriously injured and dying. What? Such a turning point instantly silenced the entire audience. Almost everyone was stunned. Open your mouth slightly. 
These four demon Dao are basically at the fourth layer level, so no one thought there would be any surprises when they rushed over to surround and kill them. That extreme profundities sect disciple will definitely die. But what actually happened was the complete opposite. One sword, just one sword. The four demon Dao martial artists were directly defeated. Lying on the ground now is no different than death. What a terrifying strength this is. It's actually the perfect attainment of the wind and thunder sword technique. I look down on you. Bei Cheng came back to his senses, and a solemn look gradually appeared in his eyes. I thought he was an ordinary inner disciple, but who would have thought he was actually a monster? Aperture opening realm fifth layer, he should have just entered Taishuan inner sect not long ago. In such a short period of time, he had perfected the wind and thunder sword technique. This understanding is really a bit scary. So strong. Kong Linzu lightly covered her mouth, her beautiful watery eyes widening. As a disciple of the Extreme Profundities sect, even if he is affiliated with Yao Wang Peak, he can still recognize this sword technique. It's Ling Xiao Peak's Wind and Thunder Sword Technique. Although it is only the elementary martial arts of profound level, it is still very difficult to practice it to perfection. Many senior brothers and sisters can only achieve this after reaching the peak of Aperture Opening Realm or Sea Opening Realm. But this disciple is only at the fifth layer level now. Is there such a person in the inner gate of Lingxiao Peak? How come I've never seen it or heard of it? Shaking her head hard, Kong Linzu did not continue thinking. Instead, his eyes became brighter. With this junior brother here, today's crisis can be solved. At the same time, he glanced at the blood refining array. He quickly shouted, Junior brother, hurry up and stop the blood refining formation. Time is running out. After a while, their blood essence will be completely extracted. She and her two junior sisters were seriously injured. It was almost impossible to move. Otherwise, they would definitely have to get up and help. Noisy. Bei Cheng glanced at Kong Linzu coldly, then took a step forward to block the blood refining formation not far behind him. The meaning is obvious. This road is blocked. Perfectly accomplished profound level martial arts are powerful, but you are not the only one who can do it. Bei Cheng looked indifferent. With his ten fingers grasping, the strong wind was like a knife, and the ancient trees around him were bent and collapsed. At the same time, an aura unique to the peak of Aperture Opening Realm Ninth Layer emerges. Covering the whole place. If you want to stop my blood refining formation, you can't do it alone. I think you may have made a mistake. Meng Chengqing, however, held his sword and walked towards Bei Chang. What's the matter? Bei Chang narrowed his eyes slightly. It's not that I'm trying to stop you, it's that you're trying to stop me. Meng Chengqing looked calm, but what he said shocked the whole audience. Just simply change the subject. But the meaning has completely changed. This is obviously because he thinks he is stronger than Bei Chang. Bei Chang must take the initiative to stop him. So crazy. Okay, okay. Bei Qian smiled politely. In all his practice so far, has he ever been so despised? What about the disciples of the big forces? It's not like he hasn't killed before. Even if their martial arts attainments are the same, but their cultivation level is so much higher, why should they lose? I hope your strength can be as powerful as your mouth. Otherwise, the end will be even worse than theirs. The words have fallen. Bei Cheng took the lead. As a demon Dao martial artist, he has no sense of honor and disgrace. Even if his cultivation level is far higher, he will still choose to seize the opportunity. Netherworld Ghost Finger Bei Chengqi's speed was very fast, far surpassing the four people just now. He must have learned a body movement and martial arts, and his attainments are quite high. Almost in the blink of an eye, I was close to Meng Chengqing. The ten fingers pierced the air, and the strong wind seemed to be able to penetrate everything, making it impossible to resist. The strength shown by Bei Cheng is really powerful, at least the strongest that Meng Chengqing has encountered so far. And this also made Meng Chengqing completely excited. Only such an opponent can verify one's strength. He wouldn't be able to kill him instantly with just one strike of his sword. Your men have already stepped on the same pit, and you want to step on it again. Don't you know that it's dangerous to get close to me? Meng Chengqing met Bei Chengqi's eyes directly. The moment the corners of his mouth raised. Boom. The terrifying aura surged out of Meng Chengqing's body. It's like a peerless sword being unsheathed. Show off your edge. 
it seems to be able to break the heaven and the earth. At the same time, Meng Chengqing wielded his sword again. It's still the wind and thunder sword technique. But this sword is even more terrifying. The thunderous sword light was so blazing and dazzling that even the darkness seemed to be driven away. Slash towards Bei Cheng. What? Bei Chengqi's pupils shrank suddenly, and the ferocity in his eyes disappeared, leaving only horror. The power of this sword is definitely not comparable to what it was just now. At least it has improved by more than ten times. There was no time to think, so Bei Cheng could only retreat quickly. His movement was very flexible, far superior to other demon Dao martial artists. But it was too close. It is simply unavoidable, can only be hardwired. Boom! At the time of the collision, strong winds swept through, flying sand and rocks. Meng Chengqing stood where he was, motionless. But Bei Cheng flew out upside down. However, they did not fall to the ground like the four demon Dao martial artists. Instead, they stomped back ten steps before regaining their balance. It's just that his condition is not good. His already pale complexion became even paler. Especially his hands, trembling constantly. The finger cots were broken into pieces. How can it be? Bei Chengqi's face was filled with disbelief. If you guessed it correctly, that sharp momentum is, sword momentum. A mysterious power that is extremely difficult to comprehend. Ta ta ta. Meng Chengqing held his sword and walked towards Bei Cheng. His eyes were bright and a smile appeared on his lips. Now, do your best to try and stop me. The faint voice echoed in the forest and seemed extremely loud. Because the surroundings are too quiet. No one spoke. They were all dumbfounded. God knows what they saw. Lord Bei Cheng at the peak of Aperture Opening Realm 9th layer was actually repelled by that extreme profundities sect disciple. Only one sword was used. Sword power, Kong Lin Zhu exclaimed. The shock in his eyes was even stronger than before. This is the mystery of Martial Dao which is extremely difficult to comprehend. Of course there are disciples who have realized the Xi in the extreme profundities sect, but they are basically all true disciples, and they are the kind who are considered monsters in true legends. But this junior brother is an inside sect. Aperture opening realm has power, something she has never heard of. Who are you? Bei Cheng took a deep breath and tried to calm down. I thought he was just an ordinary inner disciple. But in a short period of time, his cognition was constantly shattered. Especially this last sword move. Too exaggerated. Once you realize the potential, it is equivalent to a normal increase, and the power of martial arts is increased by at least 10 times, or even higher. How to fight this? Even if his cultivation level is higher than his fourth layer, there is still a gap. The new inner sect of Taishu and Ling Xiao Peak is Meng Chengqing. Meng Chengqing said slowly, he didn't mind telling his real name. Because these people have to die here today. The words have fallen. Meng Chengqing casually slashed out a stream of qi energy, which fell towards the blood refining formation not far away. Click, the running blood refining array suddenly collapsed. Stopped running, and those extreme profundities sect disciples also fell to the ground and fell into coma. Their lives were no longer in danger. Yu, Bei Chengqi's expression changed slightly. After all, these Wangquan Shengqiao pills are almost completed. But he also knew that at this moment, it was not the time to care about elixirs. What I want to think about is how to escape from here and survive. Look, you've failed. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly, then now I will give you a new goal to prevent me from killing you. You guy. Bei Cheng took a deep breath. When he talks about it, it's almost crazy and he also has the feeling of a villain. Is he Demon Dao, or is he Demon Dao? However, Bei Cheng also knew that this person had the qualifications to be crazy. If I could have power, I would definitely be crazier than him. As expected of the dominant force in Tianling province, a mere inner gate can give birth to a terrifying monster like you. Bei Cheng stood up straight, took out a new pair of finger gloves from his arms and put them on. At the same time, he took another pill, which gradually calmed down the originally chaotic energy and blood. But it's not that easy to kill me. The next second, a strange object appeared in Bei Chengqi's hand, and he smashed it into the soil. The dark mist rolled out and spread around in the blink of an eye. These black mists seem to be very simple. There are strange sounds echoing, confusing people's minds and confusing their five senses. Junior brother, 
Be careful, this is a miasma that can easily cause hallucinations. Kong Linzu quickly reminded. Then he and his two junior sisters closed their eyes and covered their mouths and noses. Miami Mist, you are worthy of being a demon Dao martial artist, he has everything. Meng Chengcheng's eyes moved slightly. Any powerful martial artist has a good trump card. The North Chenk in front of me is a typical example. With this fog, ordinary people don't dare to move around at will, and can only wait in place to prevent getting deeper into the miasma. But he is no ordinary martial artist. The spirit eye I got from my aunt can just restrain these psychedelic things. Spiritual eyes, open. Meng Chengqing closed his eyes, and when he opened them again, there seemed to be light flowing in his eyes, which was extremely deep. The original night was almost day. The thick miasma fog also quickly disappeared. Everything is crystal clear. The spiritual eye breaks the illusion. Call. The wind roared in his mind, and it was obvious that the attack was coming. But Meng Chengqing was very fast and disappeared in a flash. When he reappeared, he was 10 meters away. So fast. Bei Cheng was a little unbelievable. Originally, he used the miasma to attack this person secretly. Who would have imagined that this person's physical skills are so terrifying? Wait, those eyes. Bei Cheng suddenly felt a deep chill running down his spine, because he found that even in the mist, Meng Chengqing's eyes were always staring at him. Extremely clear. It doesn't seem to be affected at all. Walk. Bei Cheng turned around and ran away. At this moment, he no longer had the desire to fight. Because he found that this person was far more terrifying than he imagined. What he has shown so far may not be all his strength. If you want to run away, let's end it. Meng Chengqing was a little disappointed. Originally he wanted to fight again. The first is to determine your own strength level. Second, with the improvement of his understanding, he now has many ideas in his mind. I thought I could verify it through this battle. But Bei Cheng no longer had the desire to fight, so there was no need to continue. Aha, the figure disappears. The perfect sword step was fully deployed. Matching the flashing light on the sword. Like thunder moving through the mist. In two breaths, he caught up with Bei Cheng. With the sword energy approaching behind him, Bei Chengqi's face became even paler. He knew that Meng Chengqing was catching up. What kind of monster is this? His swordsmanship is extremely proficient, and even his movement speed is terrifying. Thinking about how he, the dignified Guiji Bei Cheng, had never been forced into this state by a martial artist whose realm was clearly weaker than his own. Then let's die together. Knowing that he couldn't escape, Bei Cheng stopped immediately, turned around, and wanted to fight again. But where it catches the eye? It is a gorgeous and brilliant sword light. Like thunder in the sky. Chop everything up. Wind and thunder shattered Sky Han. Boom boom boom. Ancient trees collapsed one after another, leaving large tracts of emptiness. The cold moonlight finally fell on this land without reservation. Meng, Bei Cheng was still standing on the same spot, but when he said this word, a large amount of blood spurted out from his neck. Then the head rolled to the ground. His face was full of unwillingness. With a gentle breath, Meng Chengqing sheathed his sword. He took out several pills and drank them, recovering the consumed energy and blood. After this battle, he almost knew his true level. Aperture opening realm really has no rivals. After all, Gui Ji Bei Cheng was the best in the aperture opening realm, but he didn't even use the Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra and killed him within a few moves. So now, can I fight against the sea opening realm? Sea opening realm. A powerful realm that is a complete qualitative change. It is also called the realm of transformation. It means transcendent. Because when you reach this state, the nature of your own power has changed. Like meridian forging realm, aperture opening realm uses one's own energy and blood. But sea opening realm is true chi. There is vitality in the world, and the human race has opened up the sea of alchemy, integrating the vitality and blood, and turning it into a higher quality true chi. True qi is not like qi and blood that cannot be separated from the body. In those stories, the so-called sword light of a hundred feet, the boundless sword light, and the decapitation of people thousands of miles away were all caused by true qi. The wind and thunder sword technique he is using now, although there will be thunder on the sword, it is all driven by qi and blood. That's all. But if you switch to true qi, then you can condense real thunder and continuously slash out.
The enemy may not be able to get close, and will be suppressed and killed by the continuous thunder sword energy. So the difference between aperture opening realm and sea opening realm is like heaven and earth. Be it the nature of the power or the way of fighting. They are no longer on the same level. So, aperture opening realm it is very difficult for martial artists to defeat sea opening realm. Unless the background of that aperture opening realm is terrifying enough. Maybe get aperture opening realm ninth layer. Meng Chengqing made a rational judgment in his mind. Then he retracted his thoughts, looked at Bei Chengqi's body in front of him, and searched for a while. This guy is no ordinary martial artist. His net worth should be quite high. But after searching, I was completely disappointed. Quite the opposite of what you imagined. So poor. I only have a few pills and a secret book on me. It's called, Ghost Finger of the Netherworld. Profound level elementary martial arts. After looking through it for a while, I was even less interested. The power is just that. No higher than the wind and thunder sword technique. There is no need to learn at all. The resources may have been exhausted, so I came here to use evil magic to make elixirs. Meng Chengqing threw it away. As for the so-called blood refining array, he had no idea. Although the Wangquan Shengqiao pill has good medicinal properties, it is an evil pill after all, and eating it will have side effects. It's also against the norm. During the battle, Meng Chengqing had seen the character panels of this group of people. Nothing particularly outstanding, so there was no holding back. The thing used by Bei Cheng must be a secret weapon, and there is miasma in it. As for why he is not affected by it, he must be used to it. Miasma mist is limited, so it was starting to dissipate by this time. Especially when the night wind comes slowly, it dissipates faster. The miasma does not distinguish between friend and foe. Therefore, Bei Chengqi's men were trapped in the illusion, unable to extricate themselves, and were doing all kinds of weird actions on the spot. Out of sight is pure. Meng Chengqing directly sent them to see Bei Cheng. Kong Linzu and the other three knew how to deal with it. Close your eyes and mouth and nose early. Therefore, it was not affected by the miasma. At this time, as the miasma fog dissipated, they all opened their eyes. The first time he saw Bei Cheng lying on the ground with his body separated, a look of relief suddenly appeared on his face. When the miasma appeared, to be honest, Kong Linzu felt really tight inside. Because those who are not strong-willed can easily fall into the trap. And once they are attacked, they are pigs and sheep waiting to be slaughtered, and they have no power to fight back. Fortunately, this junior brother named Meng was determined and not only was he not affected by the illusion, he even killed Bei Cheng in the mist. This strength is really ridiculously strong. At least among the inner disciples, there was almost nothing she knew that could compare with it. Except for a few perverts. Thank you, junior brother Meng, for your help. My name is Kong Linzu, and I am a disciple of Medicine King Peak. These two are my junior sisters, Tan Mohan. Kong Linzu stood up and said gratefully. These words came from the bottom of my heart. If junior brother Meng hadn't arrived, the three of them would most likely have died. Become a part of the Wangquan Shengqiao elixir. Thank you, junior brother Meng. The two female disciples also expressed their thanks. There was a strange light in his eyes. The environment was too dark before, and I didn't have the energy to pay attention to the appearance of junior brother Meng. The moonlight is bright now. If you look closely, you will see that it is exceptionally handsome. People all have a strong-willed mentality. With powerful strength and handsome appearance, who can ignore him? You don't have to be polite, three senior sisters. We all belong to the same sect and should help each other outside. How can we allow demon Dao thieves to commit murder? Meng Chengqing walked over and smiled slightly. At the same time, I watched the character panels of the three people. To be honest, this was the first time he encountered a disciple of Yao Wang Peak. Basic information. Name. Kong Linzu. Race. Human race. Cultivation. Aperture opening realm 7th layer. Property information. Root bone. 3rd grade. Comprehension. Moderate. Kung Fu and martial arts skills. Fire control and burning Yang Gong. Xiao Cheng Hua Yuan Hand. Xiao Cheng. Alchemy Dao achievements. 2nd grade. Third grade, it does meet the standards of genius. Meng Chengqing nodded secretly, but for the definition of genius, you can't just look at root bone. 
it also depends on understanding, talent, bloodline, physique, etc. Like the previous Xi family brothers, the stone man's bloodline alone is enough to be called a genius. No, he should be a monster. Alchemy Dao Attainment, Second Grade, does it mean Second Grade Alchemist? Meng Chengcheng's eyes flashed brightly. This is in the attribute information. Not basic information. This means that if you add it as a friend, you have a chance to get it. In the spiritual world, alchemist status is very high. There are a large number of martial artists seeking alchemy every day. Not to mention the reputation, the wealth alone is endless. If he could get this attribute from Kong Linzu, after fusion, he would become a second grade alchemist. I must add this girl as a friend. Meng Chengqing looked at Kong Linzu, the light in his eyes gradually brightened. As for the other two, the attribute panels are not as beautiful as Kong Linzu. Alchemy Dao achievement is only first grade. In addition, in the column of martial arts and martial arts, the fire controlling and burning sun skill is also missing. It seems that there is a big gap between these two people and Kong Linzu. Seeing that Meng Chengqing seemed to be staring at her, Kong Linzu suddenly felt a little embarrassed. A blush flashed on her snow white cheeks. But somehow, there was no hint of anger in my heart. There are even some. Sensing some silence, Meng Chengqing also reacted. Mainly because Kong Linzu's attribute panel is really good. I watched it for a while. By the way, what about those fellow students? Meng Chengqing pointed to the blood refining array. Although the blood refining array was broken and the extracted blood returned to the bodies of those disciples, it would probably still cause serious damage. Yes, yes, we need to regulate their meridians and blood. Kong Linzu suddenly realized. Then he quickly thought about it. As an alchemist, he is naturally proficient in medical science. But as soon as he took a step, he felt pain all over his body. As the strongest among the three. Naturally, he was treated with great emphasis by Bei Chang. If it weren't for the secret weapon of protection, he would have fallen into a coma due to serious injuries. Meng Chengqing subconsciously supported her. For a moment, a delicate fragrance entered my nose, and when I touched it, I felt as warm and soft as jade. Senior Sister Kong, are you okay? Meng Chengqing said immediately. I'm fine. Kong Linzu's face suddenly turned red. So far, she had never had such close contact with any man. Fortunately, the moonlight was hazy. No one could see her expression clearly. I have some healing elixirs here, I wonder if you can use them. Meng Chengqing opened the ring and took out some elixirs prepared by her aunt. There is also a second grade level among them. Very precious. Thank you, junior brother Meng, but as alchemists, we don't have it. Kong Linzu wiped the blood from the corner of her mouth. Meng Chengqing's eyes looked more tender. Second grade elixirs are not ordinary things. To be able to take it out so decisively. It can be seen that junior brother Meng also has a very good character. He is a very good person. Senior sister, please rest here first. Junior brother Meng, please take care of me. We will go to the blood refining array for treatment. Tan Zihan's eyes flickered between the two of them, and he smiled lightly. Then he took another person and left. They are both in good condition. Um, Meng Chengqing nodded. It just so happens that I can also find a way to add Kong Linzu as a friend. There is a second grade alchemist attainment. In the future, the family will no longer need to provide resources, and they will even be able to provide resources in return. Junior brother Meng, you must have just entered the inner gate, right? Kong Linzu slowly sat down, leaning against the ancient tree next to her. She is actually not much older than Meng Chengqing. No more than two or three years old. That is to say, around twenty, which is the age of youth. Well, about a month ago. Meng Chengqing also sat on the floor. The night wind came slowly, blowing the tips of his hair slightly. Under the soft moonlight, the handsome young man is like a character in a story. Heroic and graceful as Jade. Kong Linzu was stunned for a moment. Where's senior sister Kong? Meng Chengqing asked back. Hearing this, Kong Linzu suddenly came back to her senses. He quickly looked away and answered calmly. When I was ten years old, I met my master. When my master saw that I had good qualifications, he brought me into the extreme profundities sect. That senior sister is lucky. Meng Chengqing said. This is the truth. 
Many people may have good qualifications, but if they can't meet bowl, they are useless. Even if it is discovered later. But more than 10 years, or even dozens of years have passed in a hurry. Too much time wasted. In the early stages of Marshall Dow's practice, even if it is a breakthrough in a major realm, it will not increase your lifespan much. But Meng Chengqing is a little confused. From Kong Linzu's words, we can know that Kong Linzu has a back end in the sect. In this case, with his qualifications, he shouldn't still be wandering around Aperture Opening Realm 7th layer. Anyway, there is definitely no shortage of resources, and they are even better used. It's time to at least set foot on sea opening. The doubt lasted only for a moment. Meng Chengqing did not go into details. Because Kong Linzu is not an ordinary martial artist, but an alchemist. Alchemist majors in alchemy Dao. It takes a lot of time to research and learn. Therefore, the early progress of cultivation is slow. I can understand that too. Yeah, I'm lucky. A knowing smile appeared on Kong Linzu's face. There are many creatures in the world, but not everyone can be as lucky as her. By the way, does junior brother Mang have any needs for elixirs? After retracting her thoughts, Kong Linzu said seriously, thank you for helping me this time and rekindling our kindness. As a disciple of Yao Wang Peak, I must repay something in return. Senior sister, this is serious. We are all from the same sect, so why should we be so polite? Meng Chengqing shook his head. One unified harmony code, this kind of kindness cannot be ignored. Kong Linzu, on the other hand, had a serious face. Is that so? Seeing that Kong Linzu was so determined, Meng Chengqing couldn't refuse. After thinking about it, he said, in that case, I have a small request. I wonder if senior sister can agree to it. Please say, although I major in swordsmanship, I am also interested in alchemy, so I want to make friends with my senior sister. If you have any confusion in the future, I hope that senior sister will give you some advice. Meng Chengqing said expectantly, this can be regarded as paving the way for his alchemist identity in advance. Friend, Kong Linzu was stunned. She never expected that Meng Chengqing's request would be this. She thought it was some high-grade elixir. Yes, I wonder if senior sister is willing. Meng Chengqing asked. Of course I do. Kong Linzu answered quickly. In fact, she had been thinking about this for a long time, otherwise how could she deepen the contact and increase communication in the future? She didn't want to never have any interactions with such a talented person like junior brother Meng. It's just that it's a girl, and it's the first time we meet, so it's not easy to talk. Now that Meng Chengqing has taken the initiative to bring it up, he is naturally willing to do so, for fear of missing out. Ding. Add friends successfully. Current favorability. Two stars. Acquired attribute. Fire control and burning yang skill, small success. Get attribute. Second grade alchemy Dao attainment. The voice of the system sounded in my mind. Trigger additional reward. Profound level martial technique attainment card 3. The sound of the system keeps ringing. To be honest, when I heard that the first attribute was, fire control and burning yang skill. Meng Chengqing's heart trembled. Because the system's attribute acquisition is random, this obviously does not happen randomly. Fortunately, Kong Linzu's favorable impression of him was inexplicably high. Just two stars. The second attribute is obtained by Alchemy Dao. I remember that when I rescued Bai Suxi, she was only one star. After chatting for a while, she was promoted to two stars. In addition, additional rewards were triggered and three more achievement cards were obtained. This is good stuff. Strictly speaking, it will not be worse than some attributes. Integrate immediately. No, this place is naturally not suitable for fusion attributes. Then I will bother senior sister from now on. A bright smile appeared on Meng Chengqing's face. This comes from the heart. How could it be so? Junior brother, if you have any doubts, come and find me. I will definitely tell you everything I know. Kong Linzu also said with some joy, however, this small request from junior brother cannot be regarded as repaying a favor. I will definitely thank you deeply when I return. Or if you have any special elixirs that you need, you can let me refine them. I am a second grade alchemist. Okay, senior sister Kong, just feel free to do it, don't take it too seriously. Meng Chengqing nodded. All he wanted was Kong Linzu's attributes. Now that he has it, Kong Linzu has given him compensation. 
but looking at Kong Linzu's look, she knew it was useless to refuse. Besides, there is no need to deliberately refuse, the more elixir resources the better. Call, above the head, there seemed to be a shadow falling. The aura is extremely strong. Even Meng Chengqing felt his shoulders sink, creating pressure. Someone is coming. Meng Chengqing stood up immediately and narrowed his eyes slightly. The person who came was an old man in grey robe. The cuffs have the pattern of an alchemy furnace. He was obviously from Yao Wang Peak. Elder Feng. Kong Linzu was pleasantly surprised and stood up quickly. It turns out to be Master Kong's nephew. Elder Feng was obviously startled when he saw Kong Linzu, and then he breathed a sigh of relief. He came here after seeing the order for help. Unexpectedly, when we arrived, it was Kong Linzu. This made him feel tight inside. After all, Kong Linzu's master is not an ordinary person. Although he is of the same generation as him, there is still a big gap in his cultivation and status. If Kong Lingxuezhe was here, he might also be affected to some extent. Of course it's just possible. Fortunately, Kong Linzu seemed to be fine. What happened here? Elder Feng asked. Kong Linzu organized her speech and immediately spoke in detail, detailing everything. It can be clearly seen that Elder Feng's expression is changing. Then when he looked at Meng Changqing, his eyes were filled with shock. He was just in the fifth layer realm, and he realized the power of the sword. He was really a monster. No wonder he could kill Cheng Kui Zibei, who was at the peak of Tongchao. The future life is terrible. Elder Feng looked at Meng Changqing and said with some sigh, Ling Xiao Peak is blessed. I had a special physique a few years ago, and now I have someone like you. Elder Feng has given you too much praise. Meng Chengqing answered calmly, neither humble nor arrogant. But there was a slight movement in my heart. Special physique. This is something as rare as bloodline, not to mention one in a million, but very rare in a million. Since it is thanks to the special physique of entering spirit Zaofang, there is a high probability that. It's indeed Bei Cheng. Elder Feng walked to Bei Chengki's body and snorted coldly, these netherworld demon sect fools are becoming more and more courageous. It seems that our sect's suppression efforts have slowed down in recent years. Let these gutter rats breed bold ideas. The more he spoke, the angrier he became. He actually raised his hand and slapped it with his palm. A fiery red palm print appeared, pushing forward, unstoppable. It wasn't until dozens of meters later that it hit a hill. It caused the hill to shake and the boulders to roll down. This scene made Meng Chengcheng's eyes move slightly. He is indeed a strong person in the sea opening realm. No wonder it can make him feel pressured at the right time. Is this the power of true qi? I saw that the path that the palm print passed across was covered with charred black, and there were blazing flames burning with extremely high temperature. And there was also a bright palm print on the hill. It really can't be compared with qi and blood. Like heaven and earth. Thinking about it, Meng Chengqing immediately looked at the character panel of Elder Fang. Basic information. Name. Fang Qingming. Race. Human race. Cultivation. Sea opening realm 6th layer. Property information. Root bone. 3rd grade. Comprehension. Average. Kung Fu and martial arts skills. Fire control and burning Yang Gong. Xiaocheng fire cloud fortune palm. Da Cheng. Alchemy Dao achievements. 2nd grade. It is indeed a sea opening realm, but its attributes don't seem to be particularly outstanding. Especially in terms of alchemy Dao attainments, he is actually only a second grade alchemist. It stands to reason that as a person from Yao Wang Peak, when you get to the sea opening realm, you must be at least third grade, right? After wondering for a while, Meng Chengqing shook his head slightly and didn't think much about it. It has nothing to do with him anyway. The palm that Elder Feng struck just now should be the fire cloud fortune palm, in the panel, and its power is truly astonishing. It is definitely not a profound level elementary martial arts skill. It's probably high-end, really a little greedy, but it is really difficult to add such people as friends. After all, we are not familiar with each other. Do you have any special common experiences? If you want to say, we have been friends for many years, people will just think you are crazy. Don't forget to take this head back with you. It can be exchanged for a lot of contribution points. Elder Feng regained his composure and then smiled at Meng Chengqing and said. Thank you, Elder Feng, for reminding me. Meng Chengqing nodded. Indeed, 
Demon Dao martial artist like this is still very valuable. It just so happens that he lacks some contribution points. Continuously, some more disciples came to support. The main reason is that this time period is too late. No one would wander outside unless there was nothing special going on. Cleaned up the place a bit. Then he returned to the sect under the leadership of Elder Fang. Along the way, Meng Chengqing also learned more about Demon Dao martial artist from Kong Linzu. In today's spiritual world, Demon Dao can be considered a very strong force. Even if they are slaughtered by the Supreme Sacred Land many times. But they will still pop up like mushrooms after a rain. And thrive. Demon Dao has 10 major forces in total. Also known as Demon Dao Shizong. As for strength, it varies. And Netherworld Demon Sect is one of them. Located at the end of the 10 sects. There were glorious years, but the descendants were incompetent and never mastered the sect's supreme demonic skills, leading to a slight decline. However, the foundation is still there and should not be underestimated. Tianling State, where the Extreme Profundities sect is located, and the two nearby large states are areas where the Netherworld Demon sect is relatively active. Half an hour later, finally returned to the inner gate. Junior Brother Mang, I will come to find you again in a few days. On the occasion of parting, Kong Linzu said. At this moment, she has taken a lot of pills and her complexion is obviously much better. But it still needs to be nursed back to health as soon as possible. Otherwise, hidden diseases will remain. Sister, please heal your injuries first, don't worry. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly. After chatting for a few words, Kong Linzu left. Watching their leaving figures, Meng Chengqing breathed out lightly. To be honest, Senior Sister Kong seems to have a bit of a talkative streak, especially after they get to know each other well. Fortunately, Senior Sister Kong knew how to behave appropriately, and the conversation was all insignificant. Go to the mission hall tomorrow. It's getting late tonight. Let's merge the attributes first. Expectation appeared in Meng Chengqing's eyes. Return to the room. Meng Chengqing sat cross-legged on the bed. Called up his character panel. Host. Meng Chengqing. Opening square bracket dot 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 closing square bracket. Unfused attributes. Fire control and burning yang skill. Small achievement. Second grade alchemy Dao attainment. Remaining reward. Profound level martial technique attainment card 3. System. Merging attributes one by one. Meng Chengqing did not distinguish between them and directly integrated them all. Ding. The fusion begins. The voice fell. The familiar feeling reappeared and a lot of knowledge of the techniques flooded into my mind. It's all about the fire controlling and burning yang skill. The number is no less than when the Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra was fused before. It took about a moment to absorb them all. It's actually a profound level advanced technique. Meng Chengqing's eyes were surprised. This level of skill is not easy to do. Although hidden martial pavilions can be redeemed, they require a lot of contribution points. Generally, you can only obtain it after you have cultivated to the true inheritance realm, because the exchange price for true inheritance disciples is different from that of the inner sect. This is also the privilege that comes with elevated status. Meng Chengqing doesn't know if the characters of Tiantongshou and the head of Bei Chang are enough to buy a profound level high-end book. Anyway, I'll take a look tomorrow. After thoroughly mastering the fire control and burning Yang Kung Fu, Meng Chengqing also understood the function of this technique. Almost exclusively for alchemist, because alchemist requires elixir fire to make elixirs, and ordinary flames cannot refine elixirs above second grade, so you need to find some special flames and integrate them into your body. In short, fire control burning yang technique is used to improve flame resistance. Not to be burned by these special flames. In addition, you can control them and turn them into your own means of attack. Fortunately, I got this skill, otherwise even if I have the second grade alchemy Dao attainment, I wouldn't be able to practice alchemy. Meng Chengqing was a little lucky. Immediately afterwards, the second attribute began to merge. After the system reminder, information far greater than the fire control burning sun art poured into his mind like a river. It's all about alchemy Dao. Alchemy Dao is a general concept. Contains many parts. One is the names of various spirit medicines, medicinal properties, how to mix them, etc. The second is the techniques and methods of alchemy, etc. The third is, therefore, 
This fusion lasted for a full hour. The method of alchemy is really complicated and mysterious. Meng Chengqing slowly opened his eyes. Couldn't help but sigh. At this moment, he was sure that his previous thoughts were right. Why is Kong Linzu's cultivation level not that high? Because there are so many things to learn in the early stage of Alchemist, it is almost like an encyclopedia, covering many aspects. In this case, you have to take time to practice, learn martial arts, etc. It can only be said that every Alchemist is a qualified time management master. However, when Alchemist reaches the middle stage, you can devote most of your time to practice, because you have already learned what you need to learn, and from now on you can specialize in your own research and follow your own path. Second Grade Alchemist Meng Chengqing took a deep breath, and the corners of his mouth curved. This is the tyranny of the system. How much time, energy and effort others have to spend to get to this point. People with such qualifications as Kong Linzu have been working for 10 years. And he, it just took me an hour to make a friend, and it saved me a lot of hard work. In the spiritual world, there may be more first-grade alchemists, but starting from second grade, there are very few. This can be seen from how expensive second-grade elixirs are. Therefore, every second-grade alchemist is very wealthy. Making money every day is the lowest level. Once you master this profession, you won't have to ask your family for resources in the future. You can also send some elixirs back to train your clan members or sell them to the Chamber of Commerce. Meng Chengqing's eyes were deep. He is a person who drinks water and thinks about its source. Once you achieve your goal, you will not forget your former helpers. But before that, I have to get a special flame. The so-called special flame. Nature has to transcend ordinary flames. For example, the animal fire in some monsters, the essence fire in the volcano, etc. There is also a kind of flame that makes countless alchemists crazy. It's called the wonderful fire of heaven and earth. They are born with powerful power, far exceeding that of beast fire and essence fire. Some can even be born with spiritual wisdom and embark on the path of spiritual practice. Although the alchemist is not as good as those talented martial artists in terms of combat, but if you can master such a flame, whether it is alchemy or fighting, it will have an unimaginable increase. The alchemist, who possesses the strange fire of heaven and earth, is not weaker than the martial artist in combat power, and is even stronger than most. It's just that the strange fires of heaven and earth are quite rare. And violent by nature, even if you encounter some, they will be difficult to surrender. If they are forcibly taken into the body, they will explode and die. So for most alchemists, animal fire is actually the best choice. The flame is of high quality. And it has a certain ferocity and can be used in battle. When senior sister comes over, you can ask where you can get beast fire. Meng Chengqing's eyes moved slightly. Fire control and burning yang skill can only accommodate one kind of flame and cannot be easily changed. So you have to be careful when choosing. But now we can improve our attainments in the fire controlling and burning sun skill. Meng Chengqing recovered his thoughts. After adding Kong Linzu as a friend, additional rewards were triggered. A total of three profound level martial arts attainment improvement cards. It is completely enough to elevate the fire controlling and burning yang skill to a perfect level. There's still one left. When you practice the fire control burning yang technique, you must at least reach a small level of success before you can absorb the beast fire into your body and turn it into elixir fire. Otherwise there will be great danger. But if you reach Da Chung, the risk will be much less. As for perfection, there's almost no danger there. Even some extremely powerful animal fires can be forcibly contained. System, improve the fire control and burning yang skill. Ding, consume two profound level martial technique attainment cards. Upgrade completed. The moment he finished speaking, more insights about the technique suddenly emerged in his mind. It took about a moment before it was all absorbed. The fire controlling and burning yang technique is complete. As a profound level advanced skill, it is naturally very difficult to practice. People like Kong Linzu and Elder Fang have only reached a small level of success. But he has already reached consummation. If the people at Yaowang Peak knew about this, they might come and steal people shamelessly. Smiling and shaking his head, Meng Chengqing dispersed his distracting thoughts. There is no option to take a lazy break. Instead, 
he closed his eyes and started practicing. Cultivation is like sailing against the current. If you don't advance, you will retreat. This retreat is relative. After all, everyone is making progress. If you stay where you are, wouldn't you be retreating? The next day, breaking dawn, the sky is filled with glow. Meng Chengqing finished his practice and walked out of the room. Martial Dao practitioners are relatively energetic and can practice hard for many days before feeling mentally tired. There is a lot to do today. The first thing is to go to the mission hall and hand in the mission. Perhaps because the sect's secret realm is about to open, the number of people coming and going on the originally deserted inner sect road gradually began to increase. Meng Chengqing even saw many properties with quite good properties. When placed at the outer door, he will definitely come to make friends. But now, there is no need, because his panel can already be said to be very good. Second grade root bone, superior understanding, and three talents, etc. Unless you are better than him, there is no value in making friends. Soon, Meng Chengqing arrived at the task hall. There are more people here than before. It's a pity that there are still no true disciples. It seems that there is no problem with the previous idea. The true disciples will not come to the mission hall. It's coming soon. It won't be long before I can set foot on the sea opening. Meng Chengqing's eyes were slightly fixed. Since seeing the power of true qi yesterday, he has become more and more eager. With that style of painting and that kind of lethality, who can resist its temptation? It is not an exaggeration to describe the difference between Tongchao and sea opening as the difference between cloud and mud. After gathering his thoughts, Meng Chengqing took a look at the attributes of the people around him. Although they are all quite good, those same words are not of much help to him. Perhaps it has reached the level of true biography. There will be obvious changes. Come to the counter. It's still the mission hall disciple. Hand in the mission. Meng Chengqing took out the token belonging to Tian Tong Shou, which was still stained with blood. It's you. The disciples of the mission hall recognized Meng Chengqing, you actually completed it. When Meng Chengqing first chose this task, he persuaded him for a long time, so he was deeply impressed. I thought this person would come back injured and dejected. Who could have imagined that not only was the celestial bronze hand intact, but it was also beheaded. It seems you are not a simple person. The mission hall disciples sighed in admiration and accepted the token. Excuse me, this person is just careless. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly. Also a possibility. The disciples of the mission hall were slightly moved in their hearts. That makes it easier to explain. After all, the heavenly bronze hand is an apex level mission in the hall. A strong person from the aperture opening realm seventh layer, who can be killed by the aperture opening realm fourth layer without taking any damage. He must have been careless and was successfully attacked. The mission reward is 3000 contribution points. If you want to exchange something, you can go to the alchemy hall next to it, where you can find the martial pavilions and so on. The disciples from the mission hall gave Meng Chengqing three special blue iron plaques. One piece represents 1,000 contribution points. Wait, I have something else. Meng Chengqing touches the ring of receiving things. Suddenly something wrapped in white cloth appeared in his hand. Drenched with blood, he placed it on the counter and removed the white cloth, revealing Bei Chengqi's unwilling face. The mission hall disciples were immediately frightened and quickly took several steps back including the disciples waiting around to receive her hand in tasks. After all, a human head suddenly appeared. Anyone else would be shocked. What's the price for Guiji Bei Chenki's head? The calm voice fell, and the originally noisy mission hall suddenly fell into silence. The ghost refers to Bei Chenk. The exclamations continued. This is a very strong demon Dao martial artist, almost the best in the aperture opening realm. All this time, no one has been able to kill it. It's really Bijank. Some people didn't believe it and rushed over to verify it. But found out it was true. Nothing false. It's Bei Chenki's head. Bei Chenk is really dead. Gasps came one after another, and everyone looked at Meng Chengqing with shock in their eyes. Because this person's cultivation realm seems to be aperture opening realm fifth layer. How strong is this overall strength to kill Bei Chenk? Meng Chengqing ignored other people's looks. Now he just wants to get the contribution points and leave. How many contribution points can be exchanged for? Meng Chengqing asked. 
Hearing this, the Mission Hall disciples immediately came to their senses. There was no trace of randomness in Meng Chengcheng's eyes anymore. The strength of a guy who could kill Bei Chang was definitely terrifying. It's not something people like them can compare to. Because Bei Chang is a demon Dao martial artist, his reward is relatively generous and can be exchanged for 10,000 contribution points. The Mission Hall disciple said quickly. So much. Meng Chengcheng was slightly stunned. He thought six or seven thousand would be enough. There are actually ten thousand. From this point of view, Tiantong Hand is quite lacking in cards. This is a contribution point. The disciples from the mission hall took out ten more blue special iron plaques. Thank you very much. Meng Chengqing picked up the iron sign and was about to turn around and leave. Can I ask how you killed it? The mission hall disciples were very curious. He was just careless. Meng Chengqing smiled slightly, walked out towards the door, and gradually disappeared from everyone's eyes. The same sentence might have been believed before, but now the mission hall disciples don't believe a word of it. Include punctuation. Main idea. What a joke. That's Guiji Bei Chang. How could the dignified demon Dao martial artist be careless and die? Even if he was careless, the other party must have great strength. Who is this guy? He feels so strange. I've never seen him before. She should be a new member of the inner sect. The newly promoted inner sect, is his strength so exaggerated? Looks like he's another monster. Meng Chengqing left, and everyone immediately started talking with sighs in their voices. As one of the dominant forces in Tianling State, Extreme Profundity's sect has amazing disciples appearing every few years. In addition to lamenting the strength of these disciples, they also regretted why they did not have one. Leave the mission hall. Meng Chengqing turned around and went to Tibet martial pavilions. He needs to use these contribution points to exchange for some martial arts skills. Sword step, and, fire control and burning sun skill. The sect has very strict management of profound level martial arts and will never allow disciples to teach each other unless you have special privileges. The elders who keep the martial pavilions will register the borrowing status of each disciple. If you want to use these martial arts in your sect, you must do it rationally. Otherwise, it will be more troublesome to check it out in the future. Even if he said he would do it because of the potential he showed, nothing would happen in the end. But some troubles can be avoided if possible. Meng Chengqing also doesn't want to involve others. For example, Qin Feng and Kong Linzu. The martial pavilions are not far from the mission hall and stand on the top of a mountain. The blue wind is coming slowly. The clusters of wind chimes under the eaves suddenly made a sweet and ethereal sound. You can see disciples coming in and out from time to time. The secret realm was opened in advance, which also disrupted the plans of some disciples, who had to exchange some martial arts and secret techniques to temporarily improve their strength. Only in this way can you get more things in secret realm. Tucked away at the entrance of martial pavilions. There was a simple wooden table, and behind the wooden table there was an old man with white hair and beard lying on a rocking chair. His face was covered with a miscellaneous book. The body swayed gently with the rocking chair, looking very relaxed. Meng Chengqing subconsciously used his exploratory eyes. Someone who can serve as an elder in the inner sect must be very powerful. Basic information. Name. Yun Buju. Race. Human race. Repair. See opening realm first layer tentative. Property information. Root bone. Third grade. Comprehension. Superior. Kung Fu and martial arts skills. Holy spirit killing sword technique. Da Chang shrink the earth to an inch. Xiao Chang great bay feng universe palm. Xiao Chang. It is indeed see opening realm, but it actually has the suffix tentative. Meng Chengqing's eyes moved slightly. So far, he had only seen this on his aunt's panel. Could it be said that this elder who guards the pavilion has also fallen into decline? Other properties are also good. Understanding is rare and superior. There are also those martial arts skills, no matter how you look at the names, they look very impressive. Holy Spirit Killing Sword Technique. Shrink the Earth to an Inch. Great Bay Fung Universe Palm. This must be a hidden boss, who came here specially to work on his duties to cultivate himself. Meng Chengqing's heart suddenly became hot. But how to add as a friend is also a key issue. It is easier among peers and relatives. But it is really difficult for them to be strangers to each other and have a generational gap. More haste less speed. 
Meng Chengcheng was not in a hurry to add him as a friend now. Take it easy. Understand first, then act. Besides, the trump card he has now is enough. Perhaps there will be some shortcomings when it reaches the level of true biography. Why are you, my disciple, staring at me all this time? While Meng Chengcheng was thinking, he found that the elder guarding the pavilion had taken away the miscellaneous books from his face. He saw that his face was gentle and kind, giving people an incomparable sense of intimacy. Just like my elders, it feels very easy to get along with. But Meng Chengcheng thought of the swordsmanship on its panel. Holy Spirit Killing Sword Technique. This feeling was immediately forgotten. Just by looking at the name, this sword technique feels very murderous. This is my first time here, so I'm a little strange, so I stopped here for a while. I hope the elder will forgive me. Meng Chengcheng arched his hands slightly. Well, hurry up and go in. The elder guarding the pavilion said casually, and then covered his face with miscellaneous books. There was a faint sound of snoring. Meng Chengcheng nodded and walked into the Tibetan martial pavilions. Enter the Tibetan martial pavilions. The strong aroma of books immediately hit my face. There is also a strong sense of history. People's impetuous hearts will calm down unconsciously. The martial pavilions has three floors. The first level is the profound level elementary skills and martial arts. The second level is the middle level. The third level is high end. As for earth level, this level of skills and martial arts will not be placed here. It is the core of each peak. You can't learn it just by contributing enough points. Hidden in the martial pavilions are seven meridians of exercises and martial arts, including some miscellaneous studies. In this regard, Meng Chengcheng can be said to be very lacking, after all, he is new here. Each book of exercises and martial arts is placed in a black box, and you can only browse part of the content recorded on the box. If you really want to see what's inside, you have to go to the elder who keeps the pavilion and use contribution points to redeem it. But for Meng Chengcheng, it was enough. When he comes here, in addition to exchanging two martial arts, the more important thing is to understand these martial arts. I don't have to look at other people's panels later and I don't know which lineage those martial arts belong to and what level they are. What is the effect? Ching Feng Ling John. What a weird name. Quote dot 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 quote. Infinite Junkin Palm has a very domineering name, but it is actually only at the beginning of the profound level and belongs to Zion Peak. Quote dot 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 quote. The human formation technique uses the human body as the base of the formation and sets up many formations into the body, such as acceleration formations, power enhancing formations. The storm sword technique, the prisoner, extreme yang destroying cloud finger, quote dot 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 quote. The classics hidden in the martial pavilions are not vast, but they are numerous. Meng Chengcheng did not miss any of them and browse them one by one. Gradually go from the first level, to the second level, and finally to the third level. Time flies. When Meng Chengcheng finished browsing the last secret book, the sun was setting outside and twilight was approaching. The evening breeze blowing has a cool feeling. As expected of a powerful force, his background in martial arts is far beyond imagination. There are also many miscellaneous books on geography, history, puppets, formations, etc. At the end of the day, Meng Chengcheng gained a lot and was eye-opening. However, since I could only watch part of it, it was a bit unenjoyable. But when you meet fellow disciples in the future, you will be able to recognize their martial arts skills at a glance. No need to guess. That's it, come back later. Meng Chengcheng held the sword step and fire control burning sun technique in his hands and walked down. The exchange price of sword step is 1000, which is actually quite cheap. Just like Qin Feng said before, just completing a few simple sect tasks is enough. As for the fire control and burning sun skill, as a profound level high level skill, the price is naturally expensive, as high as 12,000. Meng Chengcheng's contribution points can only be exchanged for these two books. On the third floor of the Tibetan martial pavilions, Meng Chengcheng saw more profound level high level martial arts. Some of them made his eyes warm. But there is a system, and it is actually the worst thing to learn it at your own expense. So after thinking about it for a while, Meng Chengcheng gave up. Moreover, I already have profound level advanced martial arts. The Linglong Hanyu Sword Sutra, I got from my aunt. 
can be used as a trump card in secret realm. As for the future, it depends on my future best friends. Elder, I want to exchange these two copies. Arriving at the door, Meng Chengqing placed the two black boxes on the wooden table. What a studious junior, I actually spent a whole day in the Tibetan martial pavilions. The elder guarding the pavilion sat up from the rocking chair. Stretched. Today's disciples rarely have such patience. Learning more about martial arts is also increasing their martial Tao heritage. He picked up the wine bottle next to him and wanted to take a sip. Only to find that it was empty. A look of regret suddenly appeared on his face. The elder seems to be very interested in wine. Seeing this, Meng Chengqing said something intentionally or unintentionally. Yes, although I'm not a heavy drinker, I'm pretty much the same. At my current age, this wine is the only thing that can give me a little bit of the feeling I had back then. The elder guarding the pavilion said with some sigh, and then his eyes fell on the two black boxes. The white eyebrows suddenly raised. He could understand. Sword step. After all, this disciple was wearing Ling Xiao Peak's clothes. But, fire control and burning Yang Kong. This is Yao Wangfang's technique. Specially used to control fire. A martial arts practitioner who practices swordsmanship, what does he do with this kind of practice? Moreover, the fire controlling and burning yang technique is a profound level high level technique and it is expensive. But he is not a talkative person either. In other words, over the years, I have seen all kinds of strange and all kinds of things and I am too lazy to meddle in my own business. Dang even registered Meng Changqing. A total of 13,000 contribution points. The loan period is half a year. Remember to return it on time. At the same time, the black box was opened. Good. Meng Chengqing handed over all his contribution iron plates, then turned around and went down the mountain with two books of martial arts and martial arts. Interesting disciple, do you want to study alchemy Tao at the same time? The elders guarding the pavilion had no doubts. After all, most of those who can enter the inner sect are geniuses. For geniuses, there is nothing they cannot do. It's just, do I feel wrong? The elder guarding the pavilion frowned slightly. He seemed to smell the smell of power in this disciple. Forget it, I can't sense anything right now. The elder guarding the pavilion shook his head and covered his face with the miscellaneous books again, it's better to go to sleep. Return to your residence. Meng Chengqing threw the two secret books into the drawer and locked them. He will definitely not touch them within half a year. Next, continue practicing. There is not much time left before Secret Realm opens. He must seize the time to improve his cultivation. Although he killed Bei Chang and proved his strength, the inner sect was so large that he only came into contact with so many people. This is a place where heroes gather. Don't be careless. The Shi brothers in the Mission Hall are an example. Ties on seven meridians. Taking a deep breath, Meng Chengqing sat cross-legged, took out a Lingrong pill and threw it into his mouth. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.